you. What do you do? Guy ran into the elevator and scared him. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully this runs a little bit better now. Yeah, Q. Mike Panic brought up the phone as well, so it was very funny to me. Dick level four? <laughs> yeah! I need to go name change because apparently you can be ferret, but I didn't know that, so... But now that I know Mike is so susceptible to jump scares... Chad, are there any horror, like, two-player horror games with, with good jump scares? <laughs> Asking for a friend. No worries, website. I'm sorry for not being clear. Oh, wait. This is an old save that I loaded. Uh... It would be this one. Yeah, I mean, I will suffer too, but it will be funny. So... <gasps> Has Mike ever played Phasmophobia? Even if Mike has played Phasmophobia, we should play Phasmophobia with Mike. Oh man, he's gonna get so annoyed. I wanna learn Phasmophobia with Mike. I'm, hold on, I'm gonna message Mike. Hey, wanna play Phasmophobia? There's no ulterior, ulterior motive behind this invite. Smile. Oh yeah, I said ulterior because I was looking at phasmophobia, which ends with an A. <laughs> I'm just in just chatting. Hold on, I'll fix it. Da -da -da -da. Da -da. Stealth Archer. Okay, let me just double check something as well. Your parents do change your look? Oh. I see. Cool. You have been acknowledged. I'm noticing you right now. So I did notice that occasionally it like stutters a little bit on Loden, but I think that generally sorts itself out. It no, it's interesting. There's not actually that much bug in this game. There's a lot of um And I like fuck. There's there's a lot of like gen general Bethesda signature jank. But not that much like actual bug bugs for me at least. And I'm not just oh, okay, fine. You know what I mean? Where like NPCs walk with that weird slow Bethesda walk? Like super deliberate. Has the CCD issue been fixed? Um, kind of. It was more, I think, of a performance or sorry process lasso bug where even if i didn't have the sorry it, it's it was a weird issue where even if i didn't deliberately try and lasso the the uh parameters oh no this thing's actually quite strong ah, ah, ah! help 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 where even if i didn't try and lasso the cores it was just like freaking the whole thing out yeah, that's what you get. Oh, bodies.
Didn't I actually fail to find a suppressed weapon? Is this weapon suppressed? <laughs> uh, suppressed Grendel. Where is this? I can't tell. I can't tell which slot this is on. <laughs> That's it, right? That sounds suppressed. The courier can find your flat? That's always fun. I like it when, when the couriers, like... Even though they they reach our street and there's like a, a, a number on my door, they still can't find me somehow and they end up just tossing it into some random garden and I have to go harass all my neighbors to figure out who, where it is. What is that noise? Oh, it's these guys! Hi! It is defensive, apparently. <laughs> what is that over there? Is that a ship taking off? Yes, it is. What I've seen, though, like, over the last couple of days, is Starfield seems, like, very subject to an exacerbated version of, you know, just, like, when people decide, hey, I don't like this, or hey, I like this, and they just go, like, to such fucking extremes about it. Like, absolutely, um, crazy levels over it. Like, I've just seen people that hate everything that this game is, and I've also seen people that will defend every single part of this game to the point of ridiculousness. And they're all just fighting with each other. No, I don't actually know what 100% scanning does. Like... It's also, like, people just putting words in each other's mouths. Like, one guy said that for him personally, Bethesda didn't... Oh, sorry, Starfield did not have the same hook that, like, Skyrim had when, you know, you wake up in the cart and you're running away from a dragon and so on and so forth. And, and the, he said he didn't. it didn't hook him in the same way. And someone, like, went ballistic on him and was like, What do you call touching the artifact? That's a fucking hook! Just say that you hate the game and you're trying to find reasons to nitpick! And it was like, bro, he said that the hook didn't work for him. Like... It's different. <laughs> like, it, it totally has a lead-in, but it doesn't necessarily work for everyone. I know for me personally, I don't give a fuck about Constellation. <laughs> They're like, yo, welcome to the team, and I'm like, bye. Why did I just get something thrown at me? Oh, Warlock Prime! Thank you for the sub! <laughs> thank you, thank you! I get stuff thrown at me before it actually shows up in the in the Twitch chat, so I get really confused. Hunting Tusk Frog. Uh oh. It's an angry hunting tusk frog. I mean, no, it's weird because, like, the people that hate the game are just as, like, I think they're being pr pretty irrational, too, in places. There, There is, like, you know, reasonable discourse being had where people are like, I like this, but this part is weird. Oh, but the fuck squared. Thank you for the ten months. Thank you, thank you. Like, you know, I'm enjoying the game. But what in the ever-loving fuck is this map? <laughs> Oh, the hunting tusk frog is chasing me down. Hey, hunting tusk frog. You wanna go? My bot's being toxic? Yeah. Is that a suppressor?
No, that's the suppressor. I can't tell, genuinely. You reacted hype? Whoa, thank you. I learned doubles. Thank you for the hundred bits. Uh, Liza P? I th is it this month? I don't remember either now. I think it's this month, which I'm excited for. Oh. Hmm. Question, what does the Grendel count as? Like, when it comes to like pistol certification, rifle certification, so on and so forth, is it like an SMG? Lasers, dueling, ballistic, shotgun, heavy weapons. Not really. It's a- it, wait, second row far right? It's a rifle? Okay. Can I inspect it? Let's go find out. It is a rifle! Okay, so we need a rifle. Or we need rifle, uh... Buffs. So I guess... Should I go for... Do you think there'll be any suppressed laser weapons? <laughs> I like how this thing can't fucking figure out where I am. So I just basically completed the perform sneak attacks thing. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I have performed 20 sneak attacks. Okay, anyway. <laughs> Apparently I haven't explored this place. What's to explore? Whatever the fuck this is! Yeah. You bought a lemon plush? Thank you! Thank you very much! Ecological Consortium. What, what does that fucking mean? We, we don't know. Did I find a Starion yet? No. It's self explanatory No, I just mean in the sense of like, what did I gain? Say a sense of pride and accomplishment, I'll be very upset with you. Yeah, I'm hoping... I'm hoping to find more stuff. And that it doesn't end up suffering from that thing that a lot of, uh... Games of this scope have, where it's just like... There's like a few cool things, but scattered between like a hundred million procedurally generated things that are not that good.
the bad romance options. They were so mean. <laughs> I hated it. Actually, I need to double check something. I need to check my downloads because I think I goofed something. Download. I did. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Wait, why are you all smiling? <laughs> oh no. Okay, let me restart real quick. Downloaded too many BG3 sex mods. I'm not even playing Baldur's Gate 3 right now! What, what do you mean? Wait, where did OBS go? There it went. I laughed when it said dick on the save file. Aladrian, thank you so much for the three months. Thank you, thank you. This is the new Vegas planet. Honestly, for me at least, so far they've all looked like this. Do you think I can get into Skyrim Stealth Archer territory? You got your gamer subs order? Wow, thank you so much for, 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 for participating. I hope you enjoy your sticker. I hope you enjoy our drink too. I had a lot of titty milk yesterday. Wait, what's concealment? In physical, let's go have a look. Uh, oh, so I guess I gotta go both for stealth and up here. Okay, that's okay, that's fun. What should I get from the next tier? Hmm, maybe gymnastics. 
environmental conditioning. I actually, do you guys know if you can suppress a laser weapon? Like, how quiet can the, or how, how stealthy can those be? It's like a beam of light going bleep. Hey, look, a colony. I'm going. Any aliens yet? Not that aren't just like, you know. Oh, God. Is the sky okay? <laughs> uh... Hold on a second. <laughs> mm. It's a simulation! Oh my god! Re-enable frame generation interval. Hmm. Hey look, I fixed it. Never mind. Never mind, it started again. Oh, it's worse! It's worse! Ah! <laughs> huh. Does the game look better for it, though? Hey, just don't look at the sky and everything's fine. Like, do you think- do you think the- the colors look better? Or is it just that the- the... Yeah, more saturated. Let's go have a look. Oh, that's a DLSS preset though, it shouldn't really do anything. Let's go have a quick look. A little more vibrant. I don't know. Other VTubers are having issues? I mean, this isn't the VTuber problem out, this is me fucking around with mods and finding out. <laughs> Where do I go to research and make new weapons mods, chat? Because I need to attach a silencer to everything I have ever owned. Do I recommend the DLSS mod? I mean, it took my GPU use from 90-something percent to 30. So, pretty good. <laughs> if you don't need the extra overhead and you're not having frame problems, I wouldn't worry about it though, because it does do some weird shit over here. Like, what is this? <laughs> don't look at it, don't look at it! Yeah, that is with uh, DLSS 3, though, as in the frame generation one. So that's not exactly what you'll get with every version of DLSS. Did I pay for it? Five dollar. Yes. Figured it was worth putting some money in the pocket of the person who was making these mods on his own time. I'm... I feel really bad. I keep seeing this, right? And reading it as, like, epileptic. And I'm like, that's just mean. Can't kill those guys.
<laughs> yeah, don't look up at the sky, dude. I don't know why I'm trying to stealth. All I have is a shotgun. Where is everybody? I swear there was someone on the way up. Oh! <clears throat> uh oh. I found a mine! Hold on! Help! Help! Everything's exploding! Oh, well, this is... I just think... Suppressed shotgun might be my least favorite thing in the world. It takes all the kaboom out of it. Might install a weight mod. Yeah, it's suppressed, which is why it sounds so depressing. I can take the suppressor off of it, right? Yes. Oh, look, another suppressed Grendel. Is there a modless? It's literally just a DLSS mod. I don't have anything else on right now. But I do need to go turn down the sensitivity because holy moly. Yeah, it feels like right now I have to choose between... I've noticed with the DLSS mod, occasionally it stutters. I think it's because it's force re-enabling frame generation. Um, But I'd rather that than the game be taking up, like, all of my GPU for no discernible reason. Oh! Oh, fuck, 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 fuck! Okay. Everything's fine! I am having fun. Thank you. No more alerta. I mean, the thing is, it's using every last drop of my GPU, but not really... It, it, I don't really see what it's getting for it, if you see what I mean. Stealth, by the way. Like, it, it's not justifying it, because I, I, it's at 60 frames. Right now. Mm. Does stealth attack need to be with a suppressed weapon? No, but it certainly makes it easier to not get caught. It also increases my my damage when I'm using a suppressed weapon. No. What resolution? 1440. But I've got DLSS on, so it's actually lower than that. Who the fuck spotted me? Why is the gun so big? Because the field of view sucks? I mean, I think it would be nice if, like, we didn't have these hardware-sponsored titles and they ran well on... Why did you wait that long to run around the corner, you dick? And they ran okay on, on both types of hardware. That would be nice. I do, like, no damage with this thing. This one. I'm 
I mean... Hold on a second. My dream is that DLSS is not used as a replacement for... ...performance issues. Because I feel like before it used to be just like, you know, extra overhead and now it kind of feels necessary. Is it secure? <laughs> I do like how quickly I can rank up my sneak attack thing with this weapon though because <laughs> because they're not catching me immediately every single one of those bullets is counting as a sneak attack which is very funny. Of course, it's not the best kind of weapon for this, because my sneak attack multiplier is... ...kinda sad. <laughs> I'm glad to see that stealthing still breaks the AI. What is this guy doing? Hello? What's a snipe? Must have been the wind. <laughs> when was this added? Uh, sometime last week, I think, or maybe this week. Lime what says the dragon out lion goes cute, elegant doofus. <laughs> I feel like she just straight up ripped that entire message from someone. That's not, that's not two messages combined together. That's just lime about parroting somebody. <laughs> Is there a way to just eat food straight from picking it up? Pick it up with your mouth? I'd love to. <gasps> a workbench! Hmm. What's the difference between a reflex sight and a long barrel? Uh, increases accuracy, recoil control, and range at the cost of aim down sp sight speed. Um... Tech barrel. Ooh. Oh, I see, I see. Hold on. 
So I can actually put a uh, site on this one, right? No? Why? Oh, I don't have the adhesive. World, thank you for the 18 months. Thank you, thank you. Why is there so far, at least me personally? And SP Webcraft, thank you for the 65 months. Thank you very, very much. For me personally, I haven't found a research bench and a weapons bench in the same place, and it's really annoying. <laughs> Outer Worlds? No, I got really bored of that game. Like, I feel like the first planet and the companions that you got there were quite good. And then the game absolutely lost momentum. The level up stuff was boring. The guns that I were getting that I was getting were not interesting. I j and I just fell off the game completely. A chunk's chunk walks into a bar. Bartender says we don't serve food here. Chunk sit down and says, then I guess I'm in the right place. Knock knock, who's there? Broken sword, broken sword who? Oh, never mind, it's pointless. <laughs> <laughs> I love Outer Wilds, Hackerling. Outer Worlds is completely different. Don't you start that. Don't you start it. <laughs> How many atheists does it take to screw in a light bulb? None, they're already enlightened. <laughs> What's the last thing to go through Freestar Militia members' mind when they meet a United St uh, Colonies Marine? A laser beam. Why don't Terramorphs eat clowns? They taste funny. Will I eventually find better guns on people? Okay, so far it's just everyone's using a Grendel. Hi, it's Milky Shake. First time here you joined me on the Vinnie streams. Want to check out the stream? Oh, well, thank you very much for coming by and saying hello. I appreciate it. It is a pleasure to meet you. We're being. A Skyrim stealth archer, but not in Skyrim. Oh shit, don't blow up. Oh! Hi. <laughs> Give me that. G give it. Stealth. How the hell did you see me? I'm so stealthy. Oh shit, where are you shooting me from? Hello? They're so stealthy! I don't even see where they are! Wait, are they all the way across there? The hell? How's performance? Um, it's mostly fine. I fixed the CPU thing, and I installed a DLSS mod. Which is pretty much fixed. Occasionally I get like a little bit of a stutter, which I think is the mod. But it was better than my GPU basically, like... Getting clogged up for hello, you leech for no reason. <laughs> hello, hiya! I I missed. I I missed. Hold on, give me give me a second. I only have two barrels. Oh, you're so beefy. 
Hold on. There we go. Thank you. <laughs> Flawless. Ooh, a safe. Wait, expert unlocking? Oh, that sounds really dangerous. Maybe I should kill people first. Am I okay? Because, like, half the time I'm playing this, I can't actually tell where shots are coming from anymore. I like that you can shoot through the stairs. That's neat. A sniper would be wonderful, but I haven't found one yet. Like, I think all you have is, like, rifle? Rather than straight-up sniper? Oh god, that's gonna take forever. This lock is too difficult. No! Let me try. I'm enthusiastic. Can I not make a weapon into a sniper? I don't know, can I? How do I do that, chat? Teach me. Are there Mass Effect powers? I mean, one of the trailers ended with the guy going like with his mind and everyone lifted up and then it cut the camera, so I think so. But I don't think you have them immediately. There's just lots of different rifles, so I have to find a rifle that works as a sniper rifle and grow and nurture it. One of the other things that has annoyed me about Twitter conversation around this game is everybody going, Hey, hey, you should play the main story from start to finish first and ignore everything else because you'll totally have a great time if you do. Wink, smile. And then people being like, okay, can you tell me why I will? Because I only really have time to play this game once. And people just say, you'll see when you get there. No, I don't want to see when I get there. Do you know how many fucking games are coming out at the moment? I don't have any goddamn time to play this game twice. <laughs> Justify it or fuck off. <laughs> I mean, I kind of managed to get someone to kind of answer, and it was basically like, wait, that's it? It's just... easier? I mean, someone was saying it's like New Game Plus, nev like a never before or never done before way of doing New Game Plus. And then when I found out the answer, it didn't really sound like it was actually a never before way of doing New Game Plus. It kind of, it was a little bit of a letdown. <laughs> Is this it for this area? I think that's it. Yeah, we ran down here. And then down there is where we came from, right? Question mark? Oh wait, there's a bit over on the right. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's what people keep saying, and I don't know. I think you should play the way that you want. Limes, you're wrong. If you get to New Game Plus, you get to do the skibbity toilet section. Oh, well then, that's worth it. Limebot is mocking me? Limebot would never be like that. Limebot is beautiful and cute. Level 12? What the fuck are you doing here, sir? This is a baby zone. No, come back. 
I'm gonna chase you down. I think I missed that second one there. Awkward. <laughs> Sir? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Rapid rip shank. Ooh. Wait, it's a melee weapon? Oh. Damn it. <laughs> I guess I'll favorite it anyway. All that for a melee weapon. Wait, if you saw that stutter there. That's only started happening since I got the mod, but... Yeah. Oh. Hello? <laughs> what did I do? It's very infrequent, Stutter. Crap. Did Mike ever respond? Oh, I wasn't, like, expecting him to... Do you mean about power... power... Whatever? Parasocial? No, phas phasmophobia. There we go, that one. No, I wasn't expecting him to respond straight away. I mean, he might have done, but I can't tap out of the game very easily without it, like, freaking out. Let me go have a look. No, not yet. Like, am I supposed to be able to get up there? I can't tell if it's a puzzle or not. No, I haven't played it since last time. I'm having a great time. Only four possibilities. I already got them all. Oh. I think it's broken. Unless... No, I thought maybe I could follow the power cable, see what was up, but I don't think it's that complex. <gasps> Is this new? This looks new. Where does this go? 
That wall ain't right. Wait, <gasps> wait, 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 wait. Is it a thing? <gasps> oh, it's just lead. Ooh, I thought maybe it was something valuable, but no, I think it might just be the deal as us freaking out. <laughs> Disappointed. Yeah, like, look at the gun. You can see it's freaking out in here. UI bugged? Yes, it was. I fixed it. Oh! I forgot that this isn't the version, like the safe file where I had people in here. <laughs> They're all gone! Oh my god, barrel mods. Barrel mods too. But I already have a research bench. I guess I could get... Why does Lamont still have seven days? We extended it! Yay! Lamont has been stretched. Oh. So now more people will be able to have a chance to pick him up if they want to. Because there were there were people, like, every time I tweeted about Lamont, uh, that would say, like, you know, I don't think I'm going to be able to grab him in time. And that felt bad. So then Makeship were like, hey, do you want to extend the campaign? And I was like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Helmet mods, too. Yeah, I do know I do, and that's really, really kind of you guys. Thank you so much for all the incredible support. I appreciate. Two lemons. What will you have them do? How do I? Oh, I see. How do I transfer all the stuff that I have in here? Like, if I want to dump a bunch of stuff in storage, how do I do that? Console near my pirate seat? Pilot seat, even.
jump seat. Jump seat. Other side of the locker? Oh. Transfer. Hmm. I see, I see. I just want to sell everything, though. Zoom. My... Yakitori is on call. Can I go and harass random spaceships and just be like, hey, what's up? Does that work? Oh shit! <laughs> My depth perception skills are unmatched. Hey, come back. Hey, what the fuck? Talk to him. Dumb. Oh, hail. Hello. Hi. Let's trade. System, begin a transaction log. Is the stream stuttering? Is it? Hmm. This guy's stuff sucks. Seems fine? Okay. Wow, these are actually they sell for pretty much pretty good amounts. Question: Is thermal and corrosive resistance better than physical? Because these are both worse in terms of that. Should I just sell them? I don't really know what kind of uh, damage I come across most often. Oh, he doesn't have any money. Bye! Heard anything interesting? Been saving up to make a trip out to Paradiso one of these days. Supposed to be just breathtaking. <laughs> Alright, thanks for letting me know. The colonies were founded before humanity even <laughs> left Earth. They're the link to where we all came from. At least, that's what they taught us in civics class. Cool. Thanks, dude. Oh, did they, Cammy? That's scary. <laughs> Let me grab this thing. Hold on.
My dentures fell out? Oh, no. Now everyone will know. Yeah, no, probably just a model glitch. It might just be, like, a thing that happens occasionally. <laughs> Life duty is fun like that. Why does my keyboard sound better than yours? Because I spend way too much money on it. So wait, how do I do this quest? Just just to check out my ship's things. Are keyboards supposed to sound good? Yeah, sometimes keyboards sound nice. Use hand scanner to place an outpost beacon? I don't know what that means either. <laughs> I'm going to go talk to Sergeant Yumi. He's my friend. What kind of switches? I use uh, banana splits. Outpost bacon? Okay. Yeah, apparently it's like a tracking glitch. Look, look. I think it's running better now. Look, I can run and jump and sprint and it's not freaking out as much. Yay! So that means I should totally turn the game back up. <gasps> Hubris. What could possibly go wrong? Still seems good. Mostly. <laughs> Chicken and broccoli? Oh. I love chicken and broccoli, actually. What kind of sauce did you have with it? You didn't just have, like, dry chicken, did you? Oh. You fried it in your wok? But but did you did you put any did you put like Where's my snuff? Yeah, but but like did you use a sauce or did you just Oh no not again <laughs> oh, No <laughs> Please Did you put like anything with it or is it just like pieces of chicken that are Slate moist. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's fine. That's all I was asking. Also, if you want moist chicken, I recommend uh, thigh instead of by breast. Vectera, by vectera, by vectera. <laughs> I can't believe it. Is it you? Is it really, really you? Captain of the frontier, <laughs> bane of the fleet, constellations shining star of stars. Hell yeah. Then the day is truly blessed. Because for a moment, I wasn't sure if you were real or just another hallucination. 
Did he just say it ha hallucination? What are the odds? <laughs> and to think, I almost went for coffee instead. But I changed my routine for one day, and here you are. It's almost like it was meant to be. I, I really do enjoy that. How many years has it been since the annoying fan or the adoring fan or whatever? In like a decade? I just love the guy sounds completely the fucking same. <laughs> Oblivion Jesus. Yeah, no, he, he sounds the same. This is clearly destiny. I know, right? And you can try to fight destiny. But you probably aren't going to win. <laughs> Although, if I'm being honest, I'd wager you could beat just about anything, even theoretical concepts. But why would you, in this case? Either way, it's such an honor to meet you. Hey, uh, do you mind if I follow you around do you kind of feel like he looks too psych? normal for the voice now though like you kind I of expect saying? him to look like You're a potato a hero, because of because of because of oblivion lead the way good point i'll start working on it i mean right he's, away. He, like as soon as he's I a little odd looking but not not Until to the then, same level maybe i can be a sidekick in training do you have an academy where fans can practice uh, groveling at your feet if not i can start one <laughs> you won't be disappointed Is he useful this time around? Sometimes. Work and do that every day until we die. Is that really all there is to He just walked over to a random wall and was like, yep. <laughs> yeah, why would you take the hero worship trait and then not take him? Ah, if it isn't my favorite part-time security officer. Frostfang, thank you for the seven months. Thank you very, very much. Wait, your parents gave you stuff? In my first file that I had to restart, my parents just like glitched and ended up in the uh, Constellation headquarters. <laughs> in this file, they've done nothing but walk around in the hallway outside their house. Crime has slowed down since you started helping out, which is good for morale. Uh, it's a lot of work, as always. People like to say, New Atlantis is the safest city in the settled systems. How hard could your job be? Well, it wasn't a glitch. The they just decided to go to your accident. place of work sometimes. It's a lot of work and a lot of people. I see. Yep. Something just came in. Scuffle over at the Dawn's Roost. Security on site handled it, but now one of them is saying the other guy stole his wedding ring. <gasps> Problem is, he left without identifying the perp, so I need you to talk to Royce Elgin at the Don's Roost. See if you can fill in the gaps. Uh, why do you leave without identifying the assailant? Men like him aren't very generous with their time. They want you to solve a case without ever having to lift a finger themselves. Not that he'd be much of a witness, given that he was still half drunk when he got here, and somehow even more so when he left. <laughs> Sorry, wrong word. Rich people don't get drunk, they get inebriated. Which is another way of saying highly unreliable. <laughs> sure. Good. This guy's Report jaded. Back here when the matter's resolved. Uh, where's Don? What's Don's Restaurant. wrist? Restaurant. Over in the residential district. Caters to a very fancy clientele. It's the kind of place where forks come in different sizes, depending on the food. For a minute, I thought he said folks come in different sizes. I was like, yes, yes, they do. <laughs> According to the patron, the ring is valuable, but if I had to guess, not for sentimental reasons. Normally, 
when someone loses a valuable keepsake, they're heartbroken. The way this guy was acting, it's almost as if he lost a wallet full of creds. Let me know if you have any questions. <gasps> Hi, Say! Hello, Say! Hi, hello! Are you just are you just gonna stand here now? As the hero ah. of the terror, you need your own comic book, your own cartoon, your own theme song. We have got to make this happen. What? This? Is it some sort of art? A Zen garden? What? It's a communal art installation. It's supposed to look nice. I guess. But I'm just saying you could have a whole bat ball field or some food stands. Yeah, but it looks something nice. Useful. It's always something with you. It's a playground too, right? It's not how I'm supposed to do this part. I mean, I'm not gonna put him on my ship? I thought I did. I'm not telling him to follow me around, but is he just is he not on my ship right now? How do I check? How do I check my crew? Crew. Yeah, see, adoring fan. He's 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 assigned to the ship. Well, I think the artists outdid themselves here. I think this is where we met the Adoring Fan the first time. Hello. All of our signature dishes are unique to the roost. You won't find anything like them anywhere else. Uh... I'm here about a fight that happened at your restaurant. Ah, uh, a most unfortunate incident. Complicated by the oh. fact that both parties were inebriated. Oh, no worries, Milky Shake. Thank you so much again. Office, Have a good one. And Octavio have I been appreciate it. together for quite some time. So, it was surprising to see them at each other's throats. Hi, pro gamer. Uh, these two men dined together? Oh, yes, quite often. Uh, they had a usual table over in the far corner with all the traditional accoutrements. Music, candles, wine. You see where I'm going with this. Oh. But this time the two had barely sat down before the argument got heated. Thankfully, security stepped in before anyone got hurt. A little oil? <laughs> Can you describe the patrons? Well, the one who stayed with UC security, Octavio, is a shorter man, handsome and refined. Uh, his favorite menu item is the saint, I believe. The other, Hugo Fournier, is a tall, slender gentleman with a French accent. Excellent tipper, well-mannered, but a bit hot-tempered. <laughs> Do you know anything about a stolen wedding ring? I wasn't witness to any theft. And both men were wearing rings, if I recall correctly. This guy's helpful. One of my other favorite, like, Starfield discourses that I saw was one person who was basically saying that the anim facial animation in Starfield is some of the best in the industry, which it is improved from previous Bethesda games, but best in the industry is quite a claim. But then on the flip side, there was another person who was taking, like, randomly generated NPCs that were filling background cla uh, crowds and comparing them to, like, named NPCs in uh, Horizon Forbidden West. <laughs> a 
and being like, wow, why can't, why does this look so much better than this NPC? <laughs> it's just like both both of you guys are being hilariously sorry, disingenuous. <laughs> I assume that would be the slender gentleman, Hugo Fournier. He was the one who excused himself after UC security arrived. I believe he lives in Athena Tower, although he may be checking out soon. But I would start there. Like, I would say that this guy looks, you know, pretty decent. He's got a little bit of, like, stiff, starey face going. But as NPCs go, he looks great. Looks fine. But definitely not, like, you know, best in the industry kind of thing. Which is fine, because the sheer amount of people there are, they're not going to mocap every single one. Enjoy the rest of your day. Like facial scan and mocap for random people just hanging around. Oh, hey, it's the art guy again. Hey. That's of no concern to you. Okay. I told you at the end of our business that we will not speak about it. Do not mention my work again. Well, what if What if I want to work with you? Other than being an art dealer, there's not much to say. I grew up in Neon, and I knew I had to get out of that place somehow. I did a few odd jobs, some deliveries... And it eventually led me onto this path I'm on now. I never thought I'd do what I do. But I suppose life can be surprising. Back to it then. I found an old... Yeah, it was really funny when playing uh, 16 and you'd go from like a beautifully uh, captured and acted moment between Clive and someone to some like AI uh, lip synced NPC who's just like Whatever dead eye is, looking at you. That bad, right? Cool spacesuit. Oh. I'm wearing a spacesuit. The fuck? <laughs> oh. Do you, I like I kind of like this. Do you want to wear some flashy leatherwear? Don't you wish you were as cool as me with my web pants? Hello, are you okay. Hugo? Hello. Hello. Oh, I can't believe that Octavio, that liar, that manipulator, that, that... That man who charged you with theft? Yes, the man who... Wait, what? He's <laughs> accusing me of theft? The nerve of that Lotario! Five years we were together, half a decade! And he threw it all away for that waiter! <gasps> Your ex claimed you stole the ring. He would say that, but as far as I'm concerned, it's my property. He gifted it to me when he proposed. It's not his to return. Hmm. Hmm. What are your feelings, chat? Especially if he was the cheater, demanding he return the ring after cheat, like... No. Yeah, no, it's it's a gift, then the dude cheated, and now he wants the gift that he gave to the person that he just cheated on back. No, fuck that. I mean, do you think I can talk to him? Kill him? This guy? No, he seems okay. Please, I don't have time for this. <laughs> There's no crime here. I'm glad you could see reason. This ring is going to fund a very long vacation across the settled systems. Maybe I'll even take pictures. No, kill him.
Oh, that's right. I do need to pickpocket people. Hold on. Do you get experience for murdering random people? I don't think so. Let me let me check for you. Nope. <laughs> that person just slowly running. <laughs> they just jogged in front of me. <laughs> oh man, that was funny. Why did I just get slapped? Oh, it was because I used the tester button. Officer, what can I do for you? I finished my investigation. Oh, perfect. Did you manage to get the ring back? Uh, the ring wasn't stolen, it was gifted. Ugh. Really? I should have known this was a waste of time the moment I laid eyes on that drunk. That's on me. Without saying names, there are some people in this city who treat us like their personal security service. But you know how it goes. Sometimes we protect, other times we serve. Either way, I'm still going to pay you for your time. Here, take this. It's well deserved. I do it! I maxed out stealth already. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Unlock the ability to combat slide. That sounds great. Move faster in zero G, take less full damage. Increase jump height, run faster after combat, sliding or mantling. I think maybe gymnastics would be fun. I like acrobatics and oblivion, right? Kind of annoying. I feel like the pickpocket thing just requires you to quick save scum. Something to report? No. Because the the chance of getting caught is fairly high. Loading rifles gives you extra damage while scoped or headshotting. That would be nice. I need to upgrade that thing more though first. Be careful if you run into those ecliptic jerks. They fly around like they own the settled systems. And they like to use old abandoned facilities as outposts. I've been caught pickpocketing. No I didn't. Be careful if you run into those ecliptic jerks. They fly around like they own careful. the systems. And they like to use old abandoned facilities as outposts. You know. I think so, Rolderick. Are you still that guy's heart? No, it's a medication. <laughs> I'm starting to run out of credits to give you. Whoever said crime doesn't pay? <laughs> 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 Not right now. But John Tuala over at Must might. I hear they're looking for new recruits to join the Vanguard. I check with him. So Take wait, care. can I be? Can I decide to start a, uh, a life as a space cop while also starting a life of crime? Cop by day, crime by night. So fucking dark. <laughs> How are you doing? You will be as you enter the city. Please keep moving. Okay. No. <laughs> Why am I talking to the bartender? <laughs> I don't know, but let's go. Offered to investigate all of my crimes? Dude, that's such a... That's such an amazing idea. Hi. Hope life is treating you well. 
Let me know if I can get you anything. Hey there. <laughs> Always nice to see a new face. First time in New Atlantis? Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> oh boy. I didn't mean for you to take it personally. It's just something to say to customers. Break the ice. Know what I mean? Listen, you just relax. Make yourself comfortable. You're welcome to stay as long as you want. Nom, 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 that nom. work for you, new girl? Let me know if there's anything I can get you. Wait, can I take a job as a waitress? Business seems to be booming yep. for you. Spaceport traffic keeps me pretty busy. But just between you and me, I've got something in the works that'll change everything. A new drink that'll make this place famous. Galaxy-wide. Oh, what is it? I have to give this a try. You would love it, I guarantee. Only, I can't make you one right now. Don't have the ingredients. I made a deal with a holler to bring me some small samples of an ingredient I think will make all the difference. But it never showed up. Turns out the guy I hired was also hired by a few other folks. The kind of folks who ship less than legal cargo. Who would do such Security a thing? got wind, and the whole lot was impounded. Now they're just sitting on it, taking their sweet time like they always do. It's killing me. Uh... Very clever of you. Your parents must be so proud. <laughs> and really, I'm not even certain this is what I need to finish the recipe. I just... I think it is. I need to get my hands on that cargo. Uh... Why does that have an ominous tone to it? I mean, doing something about this won't exactly be on the straight and narrow, will it? Sounds like you need a helping hand. I really do. It's gonna keep me awake nights if I don't try. Before we say With anything traits, else, I'm a stealth archer. I'm in no way asking you to do anything that might violate. Oh, wait, do you mean like hero worship and stuff? I did that. Laws in place here in New Atlantis. I'm kind of annoyed because apparently there's a trait colonists. that makes it so that you this take less stamina to jump when you jump a bunch, and I didn't see it. <laughs> asking if maybe that friend could possibly find a way to get her important cargo out of the impound, and if. Hypothetically, that were done in a less than 100% legal way? Well, that might not be the worst thing in the world. You, uh, with me on this? You get a debuff if you stop jumping? That's so funny. <laughs> Hi, Axel. Oh, is it for space jumps? Really? I'm in. Who do I need to kill? What? Come on, no. I'm already uncomfortable with this whole thing. Don't go making jokes like that. Jokes? Seriously. Can you help me with this or not? Yes. God, you have no idea what a relief this is. I'm obviously not expecting you or anyone to go in guns blazing and taking hostages or Aww. something. I just figure there has to be a way to get what I need. No hostages? Well, there goes my idea. Yeah, this is hardly a life or death situation. <laughs> Some lights breaking and entering at worst, right? How do we get you what you need? I'm obviously not expecting you oh. or anyone to go in guns blazing and taking hostages or something. I just figure there has to be a way to get what I need. You have any information to go off of? I know a few things, but not much. The cargo is being held down at the spaceport, not in the security office. Still, they use the same access cards. If you had one, it'd work. How or why you would have a UC security access card is none of my business, of course. I'm sure I'm better off not knowing. Beyond that, the ship decks over there might also be able to get in. I don't know any of them, or I'd be talking to them instead of you. No offense. <laughs> Rude. Uh... What have you tried already? Like I said, I submitted the usual security release forms. But because my cargo is tied up with a bunch of, again, totally unrelated illegal stuff, I don't expect the forms to matter. At all. I went and talked to an officer at the office, too. <gasps> Yumi. Sergeant, maybe? He was polite, Yumi, but I know unhelpful. Them. I declined to suggest that as their new slogan. New Atlanta security. Polite, but unhelpful. 
truth in advertising. Eh? Wait, I'm new Atlantis security. I'm not worried. I'm annoyed. Wait, are you saying I should be worried? No, <laughs> of course not. It'll be fine. Totally fine. I, I trust you. <laughs> Stop by. Anytime. She should be worried. <laughs> The well's been having brownouts all the time. Mast finally sends someone down there, but... Why would I return the engagement ring? It wasn't stolen, it was a gift! Maybe Yumi will help me out. Hey, Yumi! Ah, crime has slowed down since you started helping out, which is good for me. <gasps> I've got a friend who needs something from storage at the state at the spaceport. Oh, yeah? All right. Take this key card. It'll get you in. But when it comes to anything that doesn't belong to your friend, keep to Ow. looking, not touching. You get me? Never knuckle. Thank you for the three years. Thank you very much. That was, that was very easy. He trusts me so much. Scan is perfectly safe. I have a trustworthy space, really? This is not the face of a liar. <laughs> a diplomatic visa? You got to Terrible, get thank you for oh my goodness for subscribing at tier two for three months in advance. Thank you, thank you. And thank you for the eleven months. Thank you very, very much. Modify my ship? I probably should. I don't know if I can afford it, though. How much monies do I have? I have 17,000 monies. Hey, this really isn't a good place for civilians to be hanging around. Excuse me? I'm security? There's something I can help you with? I didn't try and talk to you. What do you want? Hmm. Why is this area locked off? Oh, security impounded a ton of cargo and didn't have storage space for it all, so we're holding on to some of it until they can run inventory. So, you need something, or...? You've got cargo that was impounded. Wait, I mean, can I just not talk to you and just go about my business? Beep boop. Yeah, I don't gotta persuade you of shit. Bye. At the package. Hey, there's fuck all else in here. There's milk? And that's it. Place sucks. Yeah, I guess that's just a reward for having done Yumi's quests. You want to steal the titty milk? You would break the trust of our good friend, Sergeant Yumi? Disgusting behavior. Why does everyone want titty milk? I don't know, but it's it's the most popular thing I've seen people buying on Gamer Subs so far. Many orders of titty milk. I don't want to sound desperate, but any luck finding my. I mean, company? if you'd let me talk to you. Hey there, new girl. Hope life is treating you well. Let me know if I can get you anything. I have a present for you. Oh, no way. You really got it? I probably don't want to know what you did to get this, right? I mean, I want to know, but it's maybe better if I don't. I slept around. Uh... No one died getting this. I certainly hope not. This is a huge deal to me. 
but it's not worth either of us murdering over. Well, look, I can assure this will all be worth it in the end. Matter of fact, I'm going to let you have the first ever sample. <gasps> On top of that, you get free drinks. Not, not like unlimited free drinks. But you want a little pick me up? Wow. I got you covered. I need some time to work on what comes next. But this, this was the difficult part, I think. Really? Thank you so much. You're welcome. Well, that's what I'm here for. What'll it be? Hmm. Why is everything chunk? I I really, really hate that there's so many things that are just like square-shaped versions of things that you would otherwise drink. Look at it. <laughs> Is Stealth Archer good? I can't tell yet. I hear there's some sort of citizens group trying to get the old Varun embassy torn down. When I first heard about it, I thought it was a bit extreme, but really, would you want to move into that place? Me neither. And it's not like they're ever coming back. House for room. It's box I mean, wine. No, no, it's in the shape of a nice like the actual wine we is in the shape of a square. Place. See you around. That's different from box wine. Box wine isn't square when you get it out of the box. It's wine in the shape of like a solid cube that presumably you take a bite out of. Or maybe you lick it. I want to be a sniper. Hmm. Like, is there a rifle that's just basically like slow, slow, slow and mean? Actually. Max, thank you for the dollar. <laughs> There's a VSS. Where do I get it? Did I find the gun store? Isn't that like in the place where I went and got the art? Yeah, I just want something that I can, like, headshot things with. <gasps> Demer, thank you for the dollar! Thank you very, very much! Yeah, it's okay. Don't worry. Let me open up the map and I'll figure out how to, uh... Ah, yes. Frontier, residential district, the lodge. Which was the district that was that was like where I got the stolen art? I don't remember. What's on the game? Honestly, I haven't gotten further than the first few hours because I had to restart. <laughs> Don't care. Oh, please take a look. Uh huh. No, this is the first time I restarted. 
What's more addictive, this or Baldur's Gate? Probably Baldur's Gate, but that's just because that's the kind of game I really, really like. The Well? Okay. Why did I restart? Because the first stream I did of this game, like before it came out for early access, I basically spent two and a half hours having to tab out and troubleshoot constantly, which just felt really bad. <laughs> this seems like a decent gun. Hmm. Yoink. Thanks for shopping at Jemison Mercantile. Sure. Yeah, I'm actually running the DLSS mod. It took my GPU utilization from like 90 something to between sort of 30 and 40. And I don't mean work. I so mean, this is the gun story, right? I'm telling you, Bianchi, something's wrong with the boots you sold me. I wear them to the metro. Suddenly, the shuttle runs late. I buy a cup of coffee. Ninety percent use before. Up my order. It's like I'm walking under ladders with a broken mirror in my pocket. And the only time it happens is when I'm wearing your boots. So, what do you want me to do about it? I want a damn refund. Fine, fine. <laughs> I'll take the boots back. Just don't tell anyone you bought them from here. I got contacts all over. Stock may not be so reliable, but I got ways of getting things. You ask me? The real New Atlantis is down here. All that stuff topside. It's kind of fake, you know? I couldn't help overhearing that argument. Ugh, right. The boots. I hate to admit it, but she has a point. She's the third customer to return the pair, all for the same reason. The boots might really be cursed. Mm. Where did you get them? Like most of my supply from one of my UC contacts. But after the second customer returned the boots, I got curious and I did some digging. Turns out they were seized from a House of Arun ship. That alone is enough to convince me something's amiss. Have you tried wearing the boots yourself? I thought about it once, but then I thought better of it. Best not to tempt fate. And besides, they're not my size. <laughs> Have you tried destroying them? And risk releasing whatever's inside them? I've seen enough horror vids to know how this <laughs> horror goes. Horror vids. <laughs> That sounds almost su supernatural. I don't doubt it. Either way, it's bad for business. Hey, you're a pilot, right? Maybe you can do me a favor. No. I've heard of a UC station at the far end of the galaxy called the Den. You go there and stash these boots in a crate, <laughs> and I'll give stash you credits boots. as a compensation. Why not just jettison them off into space? Believe it or not, I actually tried that. And do you know what happened? No, what happened? Some UC pilot picked up the cargo and somehow it found its way back to my store. No, I wanted the boots gone. But I also want to know exactly where they are. <laughs> I'll deliver the boots for you. Finally, someone to give these blasted boots the boot if you <laughs> pardon the expression. Here, I'll have your credits for you when the job is done. Lucky boots, oh dear. Let's have a look at the luggy boots. Mm. Wear them? I don't know if I can. They're all like... You cannot equip this item. Nope, no lucky boots for me. Happy to make a deal. You need stuff? Take your time. I got all day. Cute. Lightness, thank you for the sub. Thank you so much. Welcome. Thank you, thank you. 
Uh, I used a preset and then modified it slightly. Well, this is better than what I'm using, I guess. Absolutely. Uh, this is, uh, What's three with frame gen on. Occasionally, I'm seeing a little bit of, like, stutter. But not, not enough that it's, like... ...worth going back to what I had before, which was terrible. Uh... Okay, so I need to go off to God knows where. I need some boots into nowhere. Let's go to the den. I could really use an Erdebrow right now. I mean, what he's just said is that he doesn't. He wants to- he wants the boots gone, but he doesn't- he wants to know exactly where they are. Because last time he just yeeted them, they somehow found their way back to him. So he wants to put them firmly into a box, which is fair. Okay. He lost his ship about a month back. Crimson Fleet Raid, I heard. Didn't we talk about this? We most certainly did not. I remember something. I like how many conversations you can and walk by and get quests from. We'll have to secure some other supplier. And let me guess. It's gonna be more expensive. I'm sorry, I don't control these things. I make the best deals I can. I am not a stock boy. I am the owner. I am busy right now. <laughs> if you need something, why don't you talk to Emoli? She'll take care of I love some of the hats in this game. What the fuck are you wearing, dude? Really? Kinda busy right now. <laughs> we'll have to see if that's a long-term trend. Thanks for coming in. I guess the only problem is that you do end up missing stuff if you're not willing to just sit there and wait and listen to everything. How do I put a workbench on my on my ship? Need some work done? Yeah. You should inspect your ship for heat leeches every couple landings. They'll cause plenty of havoc if left unchecked. Okay, no problem. Mm. Upgrade ship it allows you to make improvements to your ship without needing to worry about where modules should be placed. Oh. I don't know. Oh no. I I I don't know. Ah, no, this is too complicated. I don't want to build ships. Oh, did SMD just get beans? Was it was it justified?
I genuinely hate building vehicles, and I would kind of like to just not interact with this. I just wanted I just wanted a workbench. <laughs> Bye. I could just buy an already designed ship. That would be nice. I'll save up for an already designed ship. Spinny, thank you for the 23 months. Thank you, thank you. Just make a dick. <laughs> Hi. I like to think of myself as your emotional support human. Presumably. <laughs> Yay! It is the same Oblivion BAS. What do you think he did in between these games? Hold on, annoying... Doring fan BA. He was a god in Skyrim. Let's see what else he did. Oh, damn. He's like 70 years old now. What a badass. Yeah, he did some stuff in Skyrim. And then he was in Fallout 3, specifically. In the Bolivian. He honestly didn't do too much between. <laughs> How do you, like... Someone was saying that there was a way to choose to... fast travel when just looking at your thing. Is that a thing that you can do? Oh, here we go. I just... I, I held R when it came up. No distance is too far for you, Captain. Uh-huh. I do it. Um, I'd like to board. Help, help, help. Uh, hold on. Help. I want in. Oh, here we go. Dock. Dock. I'm docking. Docking achieved. Place the boots in a crate. How about Ever run into spacers? Scumbags and scavengers. Scoop for you. Like vultures, <laughs> picking away at the leftovers of the colony talk? war. From a You'll find pilot. them scouring through old That's labs. Exactly help! Your help! Problem. You don't think. If you were such a lousy reporter, <laughs> you wouldn't be stuck all the way out here. I mean... I guess maybe that's true, but... Wait, why can't I have her hair? If so... Could I have her hair? You're just as stuck out here as I am. So what does that say? Oh, wow! You really do want me to kick your ass, don't ya? All right, that's enough. Bastion, go cool off. Get a drink. Whatever. Fine. 
Holden, I appreciate that you have a job to do. I really do. But you need to consider that you don't operate in a vacuum. If you're stationed here long term, that means you're around these people all day, every day. And they're not going to like it if you're making them look bad. Lieutenant Commander Marquez, I appreciate your concern, but I have an obligation to SSNN to report on what I see. I'm sure they do know that, Holden. I'm just saying, maybe use a little more discretion in your reporting. Maybe a lot. Don't worry. When the next big story breaks out here, I'll be sure to help you get the scoop, okay? I will think on that. Thank you. Is it Robbie Diamond? Hi. I really did think this place would see a bit more action. Can you tell me more about SSNN? Why, certainly. The Settled Systems News Network is the longest-running news service in... Well, the Settled Systems. <coughs> Reporters are dispatched all over, keeping an ear to the ground for some breaking news that should be known to everyone. Do you think it he's a vampire? It can admittedly be a bit of a pain making sure those stories reach our he's central so office in out. New Atlantis. But until someone invents faster-than-light communication, it's the best we can do. No offense, but you seem a little out of place. Well, I certainly feel that way. The Vanguard pilots don't seem to want to associate with me. And I don't agree with Mr. Romack's views on the colony war. So there are few options left to me. You know, I really thought volunteering for this assignment was going to be the boost to He's my career British, that I was looking for. He's just British, that poor for. guy. Now I suspect even SSNN has forgotten about me. You could ask for a different assignment. I could, so long as I don't mind seeming like an abject failure. And I just know that the day after I leave, some giant story will break. That seems to be the way things go. Goodbye, then. Bye. I know He's sunk we're costing not a priority it. for the Vanguard or the UC, but it's still space worth protecting. I can't remember if that option was available on the character creator. Hey, newbie. Ah. It's a nice set of boots you got there. Ah. They for sale? <laughs> I'll give you, say, 500 credits for them. They'd look better on me anyway. Uh-oh. What's wrong with the ones you're wearing? Nothing. I just want yours. Why do you want my boots? You trust me, you don't want these boots. I don't know. Looks like they're perfect. Sturdy, polished, and just my size. But fine. If you don't want to sell, it's your loss. Okay. Wait, he's just going to watch me put it in the storage container and take them anyway. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> My mother wanted me to be a doctor. A doctor? <laughs> Mothers. Am I right? Mothers. Are they vendors here then? Hello there. Hi. Welcome to the Trade Authority. Jesus. I'm Marcel, and if there's anything, anything I can do for you, please do let me know. Did he just say he wants to fuck? Stock may not be as he, he said as anything and then gave me like a little smile. I will do my best to see that you leave here satisfied. Stop saying and that! seeing as the Trade Authority <laughs> is the only fully licensed <laughs> operator for the den, I'm afraid your alternatives Stop are, it. shall we say, slim. It is Stop a pleasure smirking. to make your acquaintance, and I hope this and all future interactions are profitable for both of us. He smirks after every single one. I hope we have what you need. Ooh, why is it the same guns at every store? Like, it's just a Grendel, a Coachman, an Eon, an Equinox. And a solstice every time, basically. Oh, look, uh, uh, one of those things. Good. <laughs> Fred, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome, welcome, everyone. We hope you have a great time. Welcome to the channel. It is good to see you all. Did you guys enjoy Fred's debut yesterday? Did you enjoy his stream today? Was he looking at something cursed? I bet you he was looking at something cursed. This is a picture of you. <laughs> Why smile? Why? Why are you so? How are you so sinister? 
Why do I do that every time a raid happens? You mean the dance? It's automatic. Empress Teresa? What's Empress Teresa? Okay, chat. Teach me what you learned. Te teach me all the things that you learned. Step by step, everything that Fred told you. I want to hear, otherwise he'll be super upset that you guys didn't, didn't listen. <laughs> black hole sun... Did you just say black hole sun penis come? That's not... <laughs> and wash away the rain. Oh no. <laughs> Max, thank you for the one dollar. Imagine Ebony Raven Dementia Raven Way, but godly? Oh. Oh. Limes is a fake fan, doesn't watch Fred's content. I watched a lot of Fred's content, just not every single thing. Wow, you guys, you think you're a Frederick Knudsen fan? Name every single Frederick Knudsen video ever. Yeah, my fav my favorite my favorite Frederick Nitzen video is the one he did about Eve on La Oh da -da -da, da -da -da. Da -da. Oh hi Fred, you're here <laughs> <laughs> How's it going, buddy? Da 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 da. I mean, you might have gone to like pee or something. I don't know. <laughs> you say you're a Frederick Knudsen fan? Give me the exact circumference of his nuts. Da 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 da. Um. Okay. So how do I remember where this place is next time? Because I don't think I have anything dodgy to sell. What can I do for you, Captain? <laughs> you don't remember? How can you not remember? Look at the sun. Am I liking this game? It's a fun game. I think it's it's an interesting one because there's some stuff that is a little bit jank, but there's other stuff that is really really fun. Um. I think it's actually one of those games where, you know, it's valued more by people who like kind of role-playing and emergent gameplay. Because I see people gushing on, on Twitter about how, like, they went off on this amazing adventure and have created a persona for themselves and things. And then other people are like, what the fuck am I doing? It's so empty. So it's, it's, it's very divisive. And then some people are just being, like, dicks as well. Like, on both sides. Will I play it sometimes like I've done Skyrim? I mean, I've only ever finished Skyrim once. <laughs> Have fun, Fred! Good luck! Gotta call someone's power kept going. I hope the screens there are better than the ones that I use, because when I when I when I did a meet and greet, it was fucking impossible to hear people. I felt really bad asking them to repeat themselves. <laughs> All I could hear was like the whoop 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 of the music playing at the next thing over. A lot of people are saying that the hook starts around 16 hours in. I don't know why. Odd viewer skips 16 hours, exactly. All this stuff is legit. Promise. Personally, I think daylight's overrated. <laughs> I get by just fine. He's just like me. I delivered the boots. Yes, you did. You know how I know? The rain cloud over your head is all but gone. Here, for your hard work. 
With a lady lock back on my side, I expect the business to be less bust and more boom. And let us never speak of those accursed boots ever again. What do you think would have happened if I'd sold it to those, that guy? You know what? I should have sold it to that guy and see if he ended so up reliable. dead. That would have been funny. Absolutely. You need something else? I'll be here. Oh man, do you think he would show up in the store wearing them? That would be so funny. Boston makes them feel good. What happens though? What if like that crate someone just, you know, goes looking inside it and somehow it ends up here? Hello. There are always about a million things to do. And I'm only one person. It's so overwhelming. Hey. Oh, you're not Carl. I can be Carl if Sorry. you want me to be. I shouldn't assume. Maybe you go by Carl. You're just not the Carl I was waiting for. <laughs> We're supposed to be investigating a power drain down here. People have been reporting brownouts for a while. And Mass finally decided to follow up on it. I can't be in two places at once. And Carl isn't here. So I'm just trying to look inconspicuous. Uh, what are you investigating? We're trying to isolate a power drain. Which looks like it's the result of a large amount of power being rerouted through various subsystems. But it's kind of a two-person job. Someone it's Sunday today, right? Junction boxes associated with those subsystems and power them down. The other person needs to monitor the system remotely. It's pretty okay. simple, really, and relatively Everybody safe. Everybody, be cool. Your med chance of electrocution. I'm sorry. What electrocution? This is Carl, co-worker of mine on this assignment with me. Shiny Beef, really thank you for the 98 seriously. months. Not Holy really moly, that's a long time. Thank Most you, thank are you. What goes on down here? I could assist you. Well, since you're here and Carl isn't, and I really want to get this solved, I will take you up on that. What I need is very technical. I can talk you through it remotely. I'm going to head to the monitoring station. The first box we're looking for is over near UC Surplus. You know, Antonio's place. I can contact you once you get there. Who the fuck is Antonio? Hold on, I got it. I want, I'm trying to move my chair to the right and I'm not like, I don't have enough strength or purchase to shift it. And yeah. Oh, ow. I did it. I zoomed. Medbay. I've got limited resources, but I try not to turn anyone away just because they're light on credits. Light. I finally saved up enough. Are there any sick people in here to pickpocket? Hello? Damn it! <laughs> no, I haven't done any outpost stuff yet. I love saves coming. Hmm. It keeps it keeps actually flicking to detected, so I think maybe it's a bad idea to do it to him. Why did I restart? Because the first two and a half hours of my first playthrough were just me having to tab and try and fix it constantly. You're out there a lot, right? I am now further than I was, though. So. Every time I go past one of these guys, they're like, "I fucking hate spacers." Hate them. Hey, can you hear me? Ah! I think this is working. I only have a general view of things, but you should be near the first junction box. Look for it mounted on the wall. When you find it, open it up and flip the big switch. Bleep. That's it. Great job. 
So, that tripped the secondary breaker, and that goes to... Oh, wow, really? They wired it like that? Jeez, okay. Okay, got it. Next one is way down past Jake's. And maybe up a story or two? It's a bit of a hike. Sorry. Eight spaces, simple as. Oh, do you have any guns over here? Everything good? We're here to help. Hello, gun? Thing about the trade business? Who you know matters as much as anything else. You won't find a better selection or more reasonable prices anywhere. <gasps> An old earth hunting rifle! Ooh, do you think I can put a suppressor on it? Mm. And it will go pew pew pew. It should already have. Ooh, is that the thing at the end? Just stare into the barrel. <laughs> Get the biggest one. Okay. A nine by thirty-nine. What's a nine by a th by thirty-nine? I don't know gun. I want to work for the Trade Authority. Is, is the Trade Authority basically smugglers? That depends. If you have a ship and are willing to haul cargo, then we've got some work. Otherwise, you're going to have to be more specific. We frequently post cargo running jobs up on the mission boards around town. Check them out. I've heard our jobs pay well, and on the off chance that's not what you're looking for, well, I can't really help you then. <laughs> Max, thank you for the five dollars. Thank you, thank you. Many different parties use the mission board to post jobs for freelancers and the like. For example, the Trade Authority uses them to post cargo hauling jobs. You'll usually find mission boards in bars, typically ones nearest the spaceport. You might be able to find them elsewhere, but that's your best bet. I'm not going to remember any of that. Goodbye. Hmm... I will put this... Hmm, here. Yeah, two-handing a syringe is totally normal. How else are you gonna puncture the vein without that much pressure and, and strength, huh? Huh? Junction box. This section isn't used very much yeah. these days, so maybe a little harder to see. That's Bye. the one. Next one's not too far. Dead end. Oh, 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 oh. Right down from Jake's. Accidentally right doing a little illegal here. Good luck with that, right? What's in here? Do not fret, chat. It's just a little bit of illegal breaking and entering. Mwahaha! <laughs> oh, fuck! Um... I can't take this! Oh, oh, oh! Big Bruno, no! Ah! Help! 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 Let me, let me... Bye. Wait, why am I reloading over and over again? Hurry up and fucking reload, goddamn! Is he running? Hello? I kept interrupting it. Oh. I see you, big Bruno. Ah! <laughs> yes! Ow! 
the combat in this feels really occasionally quite janky. Impenetrable power of couch. Oh shit. Easy peasy. So what the fuck happened here? <laughs> now no one will know what I was doing. A friend of mine told me you're looking to purchase a Model S, is that true? You replied, yes, my man, those robots are so badass. I've got to have one guarding my mansion, you know? How much are you selling them for? Slow down, I have one. It's a decommissioned unit that the Ecliptic we're looking to get rid of. If you can pay in cash, we can make a sale. You know it's illegal to buy these things, right? Yeah, and I don't care. What's security going to do when I unleash a big Bruno on them, huh? I have the cash. Where do you live? Oh, you are not coming to where I live. Meet me behind Orion Tower at midnight in two days. Bring all the cash with you. I cannot stress that enough. No cash, no sale. Please know that I have contingencies for people who decide to be idiots. Yes, my man, two days. Best day of your life. Okay, that was cute, but you need to come back immediately and give me my money. You are lucky that I'm willing to let you live after that. If you don't pay me or return the robot, I will kill you. I'm not playing games. You replied. Woohoo. You got toved. You got tofu food. You were like, hello, yes sir, do you have the money? Thank you, please. And I was like, here's your money, bam, bam, bam. Now I have Bruno, what are you gonna do? Go to the UC? Selling black market robots is illegal, idiot. You know what's funny? I do have the money. I keep it right next to my bed. Not that you'll ever know where that is. Bye. Are you out of your mind? Can you possibly be this stupid? You know who I bought that robot from, right? Do the words remote activation mean anything to you? Bring me my money immediately or you will be dead in your apartment tonight. You replied, ha 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 ha, tofu. <laughs> Well, how did it work out for you? Wow. <laughs> Oh, there's nothing of value in that notebook. Okay. Rip that guy. I like how nobody came to investigate, like, what was presumably a lot of gunfire. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could go with you on your ship, but I'm not old enough. Hi, miss. <laughs> Yoink. Wait. I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. It was an accident. Hi. Boo! <laughs> Did I scare you? I hope I'm as cool as Solomon Co. when I grow up. Okay. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Bye. <laughs> okay. You should be near the next junction box. And if those squatters never cleared out, I would suggest avoiding eye contact. It should be fine. Another switch flipped, another lead to follow. And the lights in here just flickered too. The wiring is worse than I thought. I'm going to work on fixing that little issue while you find the next junction box. Looks like it's over near the, uh, mm, the trade authority. Okay. Just find that and, uh, maybe don't talk to anyone oh, I didn't know! UC I didn't know! Security. I didn't know! You're under arrest! For what? I've got special orders. You're coming with me. Prepare for immediate transport to our vessel. For what? What? I've been authorized to inform you that you're being transferred to the UC Vigilance. Is it for the fucking You'll football? Find out more when you get oh there. no, I'm getting railroaded that, again! I'm liberty to divulge any additional information. <laughs> What about my ship? We have orders to transport you and your vessel to your final destination, the UC Vigilance. 
Any deviation from those orders on your part will be considered an act of hostility and will be met with aggressive force. <sighs> sure. Smart decision. It's over Stay a fucking football. <laughs> At least last time it was because I accidentally had contraband. This time it's because I picked up a football in the middle of the street. <laughs> Not again! No, my space I'm trucker you, hat! The commander's got plans for this loser. Why else would he be going through all this trouble? I still don't understand why he trusts a criminal. <laughs> Seems like too much of a risk. <laughs> Stop worrying and keep an eye on our guest. I'll be right back. I'm not a criminal. It was an accident. You just sit tight. The commander wants to have a little chat. I'm being bullied. The prisoner is ready, sir. Hello? Oh, hi. I hope you're comfortable. We have a lot to discuss. We recognize his voice, right? Didn't we talk to the, talk about this last time? I know his voice. Let me just pay my fine so I can get out of here. Not this time. I did it. So, let me see what we're working with here. That you have a background in cyber. Oh, right? yeah, Javi. I remember now. Thank you. It was a fucking here. football. I also see that you mined on Vectera, and now you're with Constellation. You've certainly been quite busy. Oh, and look at that. Right at the bottom of this list is the criminal incident that landed you in <laughs> my crosshairs. <laughs> He was a football. Right. Well, I'll have my people get right <laughs> on that. Now that uh, we have that out of the way, let me introduce myself. My name is Commander Kibwe Ikande, and I'm in charge of this operation for UC Sistev. Are you familiar with what we do? No matter what I do, I always end up getting this cutscene because I apparently am a criminal by nature. I know you kidnap people. Actually, that's something new we're trying. I figured we needed to branch out a bit, broaden our horizons. <laughs> UC Sistev is a division of the UC Navy. Well, they handle the big picture stuff, we deal with a very particular problem. The Crimson Fleet. Yeah, I feel like you should that have a decently sized bounty to get picked up by yeah. these guys. A football ain't it. I have nothing to do with the Crimson Fleet. No. to take them down one ship at a time but we barely scratch the surface if we can get someone on the inside we have a shot at finding a loose thread we can pull to bring it all down uh you want me to risk my neck and go undercover for Not you for, me. for yourself look i'm going to make this simple agree to work for uc sistev and together we take down the Crimson Fleet. Refuse, and I tell these guys to throw you into the nearest lockup. Might even tack on an extra few hundred credits to your fine. <sighs> I didn't realize coercion was a part of your code of ethics. I'm not coercing you into doing anything. I'm simply giving you a chance to redeem yourself. So, what do you say? You going to work with me? You're sure, pretty well, sure this I is plot related? I'm, it, no, it's a side quest that you can get from being, like, or from getting caught doing criminal stuff. I know I can even handle this type of operation. If I didn't think you had a chance, I would have left you in locker. You didn't leave me anywhere! You guys specifically picked me up! Me. What the fuck do you mean? You, you arrested me specifically with the reason of coming here! Fuck off! Smart choice. I'm going to have one of my men escort you to the operations center. I strongly suggest that you don't give him any trouble. And don't bother trying to leave the ship. I think you'll find all access to the docking area is fully restricted. Uh, 
What have I learned? I haven't learned anything. This is bullshit. I'm being persecuted. So, you took the op instead of serving the time. Gonna be the commander's new mole, huh? I'm a ferret? Yes. Going in all alone, what? infiltrating a bunch of pirates. You've got a lot of guts. Still, it makes you wonder. Is it worth it over a football? With the stories that go around. <laughs> it's like the one about how the fleet deals with informants by lashing them to the hull of a ship and then slowly letting the air out of their suit. Could you imagine a worse way to go? I know I, I can't pickpocket this fucker. It's sad. But I wouldn't worry about it. Since the commander handpicked you, I'm guessing you can hold your <laughs> breath for a really long time, right? You do 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 <laughs> no problem. <laughs> I look like I'm running up to pinch his ass. <laughs> Hi. All right. This is as far as I go. Take the lift up to Ops. Commander Ikande should be waiting for you. Whee! I mean, I don't like the Crimson Fleet because they attacked me, so I figure I'll be a complete hypocrite and do lots of crime things, but completely self-serving, while wiping the Crimson Fleet off of the face of the earth. Howdy. Sup? Hey. Hi. Yes. Is he short? Oh my god, he is. Oh wait, no, it's because he's wide stancing. Why are you wide stancing at me, dude? You good? Ah, there you are. Excellent. Now that we've established your level of cooperation with us, I want to introduce you to your new home. This is the operation center of the UC Vigilance. Sysdef's nerve center dedicated to the destruction of the Crimson Fleet. Ah, uh, this is such a fucking stupid option. I just die. Ah. Uh. You need more than one ship? Which is precisely why we're taking a more... Oh, you think he's got a sore approach. crotch? So he's we trying to air it out a little bit? ...inside the Crimson Fleet. Someone who can feed us um. information, evidence, and expose their weaknesses. The catch is that you can't just knock on their front door and ask for an application. Getting inside is going to take some finesse. They took my trucker hat. I assume you've chosen me because I'm expendable. Let's get one thing straight right now. While you're working for me, I'm going to treat you like one of my own. Really? Whatever crimes you committed in the past no longer matter. You're now an agent of Sisdev. Like we're that family? It's my job to keep you alive. Are you my daddy? I assume you already I have do. a plan. Our intelligence has managed to find a possible opening into the Crimson Fleet through Sersha Bolden, one of their contacts. She works for the Trade Authority in Sidonia, so you'll be using a container of Aurora we've loaded on your oh, ship. Oh yeah, to we're going get to Sidonia. Do you think I should go and talk to Constellation then? Because they want to go to Sidonia Sedo too. That's right. So it'll be your job to convince this person that you're the real deal. Once you block your way into the Crimson Fleet, then the operation proceeds to evidence gathering. That's where my second in command, Lieutenant Jillian Topt, comes must have quite a bit of confidence in my abilities. If I didn't have confidence in your abilities, we wouldn't be having this conversation. Can you imagine this guy's like, look at her. Look Remember, at the finesse in which she stole that football. Oh my god. To I need to work with her. And bring us the evidence we need to take them down. Sure. I wouldn't expect any less. Look, before you begin, I want to make something perfectly clear. As an undercover operative for UC Sysdef, you'll be expected to follow our code of conduct and ethics. 
Allow yourself to stray too far off the path and you stand a good chance of spiraling out of control. If you're worried about that kind of thing, maybe you shouldn't work with people who are criminals. And coerce us into doing things for you. Fuck! Doing things for you. Uh... Can you explain your code of conduct and ethics? To put it simply, you can't go into every situation with guns blazing. Think before you act. Calculate what you're doing and pull the trigger only when it's absolutely necessary. At the end of the day, your primary goal is taking down the Crimson Fleet. That's the greater good. Uh, I don't do well following rules and regulations. Well, you better learn quick. Otherwise, I'll start looking for someone to take your place. <laughs> anyway, it's time to hand you over to Lieutenant Toft. She'll brief you about the details of the evidence gathering portion of the operation. Is there a thieves' guild in this game? Get out that would be nice. There. And good luck. For your own safety, nobody but myself and the crew of the Vigilance will be aware that you're working for the United States. Why is he bald? Colonies. You can't just ask people why Basically, they're bald. If you land in jail, you're going to have to deal with the fines. Uh... That's easy to answer. You don't. We'll be monitoring your activities from the Vigilance and attempting to keep it within your vicinity. When you feel you've gathered enough evidence and at the completion is this of your assignments, maybe I know he's Javik from debrief. Mass Effect. Beyond that, uh, that would actually make sense. Seer does sound own. like Javik. Dismissed. Hold on, let's have a look. Seer Apex VA. Uh, yeah, same guy. All right, we don't have a lot of time, so I need you to listen up. While you're working undercover, it's imperative that you gather as much evidence as possible. If you find any records that look suspicious or incriminating, you bring it to me. Is that understood? So you want me to steal from thieves? Rationalize it however you like. But that evidence is critical to the success of Commander Akande's operation. I want data slates, computer downloads, handwritten notes. Hell, I'll take anything if it'll get those bastards thrown into the brig. For the sake of the settled systems, I hope you're right. That minor skirmish you had with them on Bactera was nothing compared to the death and destruction that's Leongo, I win. If you've seen what I've seen, you'd understand why I'm pushing you so hard. You want to talk about what? it? No, it's personal. Has nothing to do I with think you. you should get overly Just emotionally attached to the prisoner fine. that you have uh, blackmailed into working with you. <laughs> That's all we're asking. Oh, before you go, there's one more thing. Commander Akande has authorized a credit do you think, disbursement. Do you think? Do you think I can like piece of evidence that you return? Do you think I can seduce her and use her to get out of my 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 service? Why would you be paying credits during a military well, operation? That's just it. You're not career military, are you? No. And speaking frankly, you're completely out of pocket during this operation. You'll be paying for your own supplies and other unexpected incidentals. So if I were you, I'd stop asking questions and accept the compensation. Hey. It's not generous, it's motivational. Commander Akande's idea. All right. We've loaded a container of Aurora into your ship's cargo hold. We're also providing you with a sample you can use to tease the goods. We've cleared your ship for launch. Proceed to Sidonia. Make contact with Searsha Bowden. And with any luck, she'll point you to the Crimson Fleet. That should do it. You're dismissed. Oh, okay. Feel like discussing your personal experience with the Crimson Fleet? Not really, no. 
I've learned to keep my personal experiences separate from the job. But what if, what if I took you somewhere with mood lighting and alcohol and plush couches? <laughs> uh, if something's on your mind, it'll make you feel better to get it out into the open. Yeah. <gasps> Maybe. No. No, it... <laughs> It's not really an appropriate time to be going do over it. my private life. There are much more important things to be done. Let's just stick to the job at hand and concentrate on the mission. But, uh, maybe we can talk about it some other time, okay? There's no way I'd ever use it against you because I'm a good person. We'll be here if you need us. <laughs> Pardon. Whoop. Criminal. Hey. I can't believe I get to stand near you, breathing the same air. I've got to have every molecule. How do I throw things at him? Fuck. I don't want to shoot him because he'll die, but I do want to abuse him a little bit. Eh. Fuck. Eh. No, but I did see that in Japanese, they accidentally left the guy saying, uh, like, sorry at the end of his line? Or something like that? You know, like how they did with the lady who was like, oh shit, let me do it again, or whatever. They left one of those in, in the Japanese dub, which is very funny. <sighs> okay. Oh yeah, I was in the middle of something. You dicks. Help. Help. No, 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 not the vigilance. No, I was pointing at the... Sure, whoever's in that chip will be thrilled to see you. <laughs> Off we go again. Where's... where's... <gasps> Cow! Welcome back! Thank you again, Sam Who Now! No, no, how do I... Fine, you know what, I'm gonna leave- I'm gonna leave the Vigilance behind a little bit, and then I'm gonna do it. There we go, first try, smooth. No contraband. Scan complete. You are cleared to land at New Atlantis. Please enjoy your visit to Jemison. How am I doing? I'm doing good, thank you. Yeah, no, she gives you some Aurora. But, uh, oh, I forgot to pick the option this time around, but last time I asked about it, she told me that it's, like, cleared, so it won't get me flagged. 
But if I try and sell it, they'll arrest me. No, I just said you if you if you try and sell the Aurora, they will be very, very upsetty spaghetti at me and I'm going to jail. You know what? I should have just told them to let me do my time. How much time would I have to serve for like picking up a football? Been up there, huh? Space? Must be cool. <laughs> Da 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 Oh Okay, the final box I need you to deal with should be right around there. Unfortunately, I just realized you're in for a real tangle of gabling. Like 200 years of Phil attempts to rewire things. I tried to fix it three years back and was crying by the second day. Gave up on the third. Anyway, this should be a series of secondary breakers hmm. you need to deal with before you can access the junction box. I don't remember the order. But flip levers until all those circuits are powered down. <laughs> wow, you got it. Really well done. You saved me like a week of work. Scuttles the sea slug. Thank you for the sub. Where we met. Thank you very, very much. Welcome aboard. That took me like, what, two seconds and it made her cry? <laughs> hmm. It's some of the hairstyles. <laughs> Goodness, Xylicious, thank you so much for the sub. I like your name. Thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you, Scuttles. I appreciate that. I'm glad I'm glad that I could. Also, I'm starting to notice like a running trend in games because I was watching I was watching uh through the half light highlight reel that's coming soon, by the way. Um, I was watching that and I threw a grenade into a glass wall like three times because I couldn't I didn't realize that it was actually glass. <laughs> And I keep running into glass in this game, too. Where the heck am I going here? Snuffy brought you here? Oh, Well, thank, thank you for coming to hang out. I love Snuffy. Okay, I don't know where to go. He's like, it's near where we met! I don't have any fucking clue how to get there. Maybe up here? This looks right. Yeah! Ooh, she has a safe. You found them all. And really quickly, too. I'm impressed. <laughs> you didn't Did notice the lapse you? where I just, like, went because off planet halfway through? You. There's no way I could have done that in a reasonable amount of time all by myself. <laughs> Happy to help. Well, not everyone would be, and I appreciate it. Thanks to your help, I was able to trace the power drain. I know where it's coming from. Unfortunately, the source is exactly where I was afraid it was. The trade authority. Mm. So those that's criminals that I'll need to deal with. That'll be fun. If you want to tag along, I certainly wouldn't complain, but if not, then this is where we part ways.
Bye. Chad, I'm sleepy. Would it surprise you to know that I was asleep up until half an hour before the stream? This was pretty low on the list of things I wanted to do today. So thanks to you, we've got evidence that the trade authority is behind the power drain being reported down here. <laughs> I don't know if you ever dealt with the trade authority, but Zoe is intimidating. I have to go in there, but I really, really don't want to. You think you'd be willing to go with me? Just make sure this doesn't go badly? Sure. I'm very diplomatic. What are you worried about? I don't know. I feel like I'm the one who's going to wind up in trouble. It's always got a way of twisting It did things. get extended, yes. So if you, if you are interested, plenty of time still to pick one up. I just wanted to make sure everyone had the best chance possible because there were people who were talking about how they weren't going to be able to grab one. What the fuck? Before it ended. Thanks. That means a lot. I can do the talking, I think. Just be ready for, well, anything. People joke, say those Varun zealots worship a snake. But let me tell you, it ain't a snake. It's some kind of celestial being. They call it the Great Serpent. Is it real? Hell if I know. But they think it is, and that makes Okay, bye. Who's he talking to? I don't know. He started following us. <laughs> I thought it was, I thought he was gonna like chase us down, try sell us something. Stop bitching each other out! You'll have to remind me of me, dear. I'm afraid I can't keep track of all you little worker drones. Help! I'm Luisa Reyes. Well, you know that. Because I've been in here three times. Yes, yes, of course you are. And what was it you were accusing me of with absolutely no evidence? The power drain is coming from your building, Zoe. You and I both know it. And now I can prove it. <gasps> I'm sorry. What? We traced the drain. Checked the grid. It led us here. You... You can't talk your way out of this. Ugh. I'm going to ask you to wait here a moment. <laughs> I'll be right back. She's okay. gonna fucking bolt. I can do this. Okay, just be ready for anything. I don't know if she's going to come out of there with a gun or call in mercenaries or what. I don't want this to turn out violent if we can avoid it, okay? Uh huh. Everything's okay. gonna be fine. You're probably right. Just need to breathe. Oh. Well, Miss Reyes, I apologize for not taking this matter more seriously. <laughs> I assure you, I will eagerly assist in getting to the bottom of this. No, you're not weaseling out of this. We got to the bottom of it. You are the bottom. <gasps> I appreciate your enthusiasm for your work, but I do a little more research before casting aspersions. Someone has indeed been using this location through which to route electrical power. It is not the Trade Authority. I've had my suspicions for a while, and I've been keeping detailed notes, which I'm happy to share with you. For now, though, what do we do next? Jonathan, I... thank you for the 21 months. Wait, thank you, thank you. What? Oh, for heaven's sake. I presume you've been assisting Miss Reyes in tracking down this little problem. Well, clearly there's more work to be done. 
why don't you continue the work you've been doing with an assurance that the trade authority will compensate you for your time? I'll coordinate things here with Miss Reyes. With Mast's access to the grid, we'll find out who did this soon enough. And why. Presumably, you're the one who's been doing the field work, so... I believe you'll find there's another junction box out there in the well that needs your attention. Okay, well, this is not how I saw this going. Uh -huh. For the moment, let's assume this is all legitimate. I can sort out the details with Zoe. So why don't you go investigate the next junction box? This quest is nothing but junction boxes! Just one quiet day. Not too much to ask for? Welcome me, welcome! I'm gonna go up there. Oh. Hmm. Parkour! Nope. Do you think I can make that? Yeah, we You should be getting close. Oh god. Hello? Provide updates for any suspicious activity. Is that clear? And Zoe's here too, if you hadn't guessed. We've agreed to work together. You think they'll on kiss this. at the end? Once you throw the switch, we can direct you to the next junction box. That's it, thanks. Let's just take a look here. Okay. You're going to want to head for box 45A. It should be near Apex Electronics. <sighs> you can't possibly be serious. Are you looking at the same diagram I am? 47B is obviously the next one, it's on the same level. Zoe, I know how to read. Ignore her. Head for box 45A, okay? <laughs> yeah, I think that's the one that Zoe wants, so let's go for the other one. <gasps> I'm vending! Grab us his success. I think we should store the case in here for a few weeks. You see security will be on alert now that something's gone missing from the surface. That's the only reason they do anything down here. I don't expect anyone else to know about this room. Honestly, we may be the first ones to come here in years. I found a thing. Secret hidden thing. Arc welder. <laughs> it's a heavy weapon, apparently. Hmm. Yoink. Is this the correct place? Thank you for trusting that a lifelong employee of Mass knows what she's talking about. Oh, please. I'm sure you can handle whatever challenge might be associated with reaching the box. You're doing great. And that was indeed the correct junction box. See that, Zoe? Yes, yes, fine. Let's move on. <laughs> okay, just making sure you saw it. So, now things get interesting. I can't find the next spot on any of my current diagrams. And I can begrudgingly confirm that she's reading them correctly. We've reached the conclusion that it must be somewhere on the surface, outside the well. Miss Reyes has suggested that this means it's somehow no longer her responsibility. I frankly don't care. I want to find this person. And here's where I begrudgingly agree with Zoe. It's not technically my problem at this point, but I want to see where this trail leads. If you head that 
topside. I'll pull the diagrams we'll need and contact you. They want to cuddle so bad. <laughs> Keep your nose clean. Last thing I want is to charge you for a DP, an A and B, B and E, or heaven forbid, an MS. But at least then we wouldn't have to worry about a VOP, am I right? They charge me for a DP? Blind me. Reyes is still collecting the necessary diagrams and blueprints to accurately assess the situation. Before she returns, I'm going to make you an offer. Of course you are. Whatever you find at the end of this path, you bring it to me first. I'll be certain that Mast gets what it needs, but I trade in valuable information. I suspect you're going to find some. I guarantee you the trade authority will pay well. Consider that as you head towards the residential district. We can't pinpoint the source yet, but it's somewhere over there. Sure hope your day's going as well as mine is. If you ask me, it's always a good time for a Terra Brew. <laughs> Do you live around here? What, at Terra Brew? I wish. <laughs> nah, I, I live at Athena Tower. Just moved in, actually. My girlfriend and I got a place there a few weeks ago. I'm not sure how long we'll be there, though. We're saving up to get out of New Atlantis and uh, tour the settled systems. He kind of sounds like someone's trying to do uh, a Jesse Pinkman voice, but not very well. Will you tell me more about your girlfriend? Yeah, sure. Her name's Donna. She works at the Nat Station near Mast. Oh, boy, is she a catch. She's passionate, beautiful, friendly. I really lucked out. We met a couple of years ago, and uh, we've been going steady since then. I'm actually thinking about asking her to marry me pretty soon. Uh, keep that between us, okay? I'm gonna go find her and tell her. Find it out before I pop the question. <laughs> Where? Uh, uh, what did they say? Not over I my guess. mast. Do we know each other? No, but I'd like to get to know you better. <laughs> Wait, are you flirting with me? Yeah, sure. Oh, uh, look, I'm I'm really flattered, but. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have to ask you to stop. I already have a girlfriend. Oh. You seem great, though. I'm sure you'll find someone. Catch you later, yeah? Okay. Catch you later, yeah? Catch you later, yeah? Yeah, he sounds like if someone mashed Jesse Pinkman with Badger, so that he got, like, the hoarseness, too. I'm going to mask because I want to see if I can find the girlfriend. What was her name? Donna? Yeah, he got weird when I asked how he was, but he was perfectly willing to tell me where his girlfriend works. That's kind of fucking weird, dude. I'm so excited to see Tony after work. How much she needs She's still so excited to see Tony after work. Nat station. That's right, right? Mm-hmm. Wait, that was her? Oh, wait, 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 wait! Because his name was Tony, right? Hold on. What the fuck? Where was she? Donna! <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Oh, no. This is really awkward. One <laughs> day. I'm gonna leave New Atlantis for Did good. you think do you think he got confused because I was like dressing like his girlfriend or something? I wonder if I'll miss New Atlantis when Tony and I leave. No, probably not. How's it going? Oh hi there. I'm doing great. How about you? I've been struggling to find meaning in my life. Hmm. We've all been there, I think. <laughs> Maybe you just need to find a goal to strive towards. I've been trying to save up enough money so that I can go explore the settled systems with my boyfriend, Tony. I think we're finally getting close. Wow. No offense, but you look a little bit tired. <laughs> Starfield keeps crashing and no, it's not your computer. Um, do you have any undervolt overclock settings on your CPU or your GPU? Have you updated your drivers?
Really? Well, I guess you're right. I'm feeling a bit run down. I really love my job, but it's hard work and long hours. I could definitely use the Terracino from Terra Brew right now. I want you guys to pay attention to the fact that when she's talking, it does kind of look like there's something inside her mouth, but it's not moving like a tongue should. And it's kind of like voidy and weird in there. And you know what it reminds me of? You know, you know that Doctor Who episode where those weird creatures were like putting themselves inside people's mouths? Would it help if I turned around? No. Really? That's so sweet. I really appreciate it. I'm going to give Take a Terra Brew to her. One second. Where's Terra Brew? Uh, it was back where I was, right? Oh, the commercial district? Okay. How the fuck do I get there? D Zero, thank you for the sub. Thank you very, very much. And Coffee Kindred, thank you for the 39 months. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for choosing Terra Brew. What can I get you? I'm pretty sure there's more than one Terra Brew thing because I remember being told about this. Come. Yeah, there we go. Yes. And the sales in the fest didn't dip at all when the second store opened. Impressive. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there was another Terra Brew location. That's your favorite thing on the menu. Corporate policy requires me to state that everything Terra Brew offers is my favorite. Certainly. Please take your time. Uh, was it the terrible cappuccino that she wanted? Snuffy, I remember Snuffy saying that she was super happy that I did pants as part of my merch drop because nobody does pants and she wants she wants to wear my pants. So I was very happy to be able to please Snuffy in that way. Not like that. Hey Donna. Another day, another credit. What are you doing? I have a feeling today's going to be a great day. Don't you agree? Here's a Terracino you wanted. Oh, thank you so much. Soon I'll be coursing with bountiful energy. She's so fucking I'll be nice. The most enthusiastic janitor <laughs> in New Atlantis. Here, take this. I found it while I was cleaning. I figured you might find a use for it. Thanks again. I really appreciate it. She gave me milk? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. She found milk while she was cleaning and she gave it to me as a gift? What? <laughs> Yay? I should just get out of here. Go join Lizzie. Why do you want to leave New Atlantis? Tony and I want to see what else is out there. I love my job, but there has to be more to life than just being a janitor in New Atlantis. What about you? Have you gone on any adventures? Uh I'm working with Constellation to hunt down artifacts. Wow. <laughs> I have no idea what that means, but that sounds really important. I'll keep my eyes peeled for any artifacts, okay? Thanks. Anything you recommend doing in New Atlantis? 
Hi, Chitev. Thank you for the two months. Thank you, thank you. Well, that depends. Are you a foodie or a shopper? I've asked them, Cammy, and they said that they'll check in on Tuesday because Monday is Labor Day and the warehouse isn't operational. And they'll give me an update, yeah. Mm. I, I, I just can't bring myself to tell her that I want to do something illegal. She's just so nice. She's just smiling at me. I like spending credits. You should check out the commercial oh, district. There's some cool shops there. And if you want a whole new look, there's even an enhance. Does she? Did she not have teeth the last time we talked to her? Should you upgrade your GPU for this? It's a weird one because I haven't seen anything officially confirmed by the developers, but I'm seeing a lot of people talk about how their GPUs are getting run to 100% and they're getting if bad. Shy, it's okay. We can just stare awkwardly at each other. Yeah, I'm seeing people saying that their GPUs are registering 100% load, but they're not actually drawing any power. Like, um... Like, I'm seeing people say, yeah, I'm getting 100% load on my GPU, but it's only drawing, like, 180 watts of power on a 4090 or something stupid. Which sounds like something is, like... Kind of, like, getting, I don't know, bottlenecked or something? I don't know. Because, yeah, it's definitely not utilizing GPUs to the max, and I refuse to believe that this game needs 100% of a 4090 and it can't even hit 60 FPS consistently. So there's, and I'm seeing like worse, C, uh, worse performance on 4,000 series cards than I am on 3,000 series cards. So something is very weird. Are you okay? <laughs> Do you need to go get help or something? <laughs> I'm also seeing a lot of people saying that performance on AMD cards is better. I cleaned up a kid's vomit today. So I would probably wait Four for times. stability patches before investigating, or sorry, before investing in a bunch of new hardware. See you around. Well, I got a skill point. So I want to go to the commercial district. I have the DLSS mod on now. It works okay, but I'm getting more stutter than I used to, but in terms of my GPU utilization, at least I'm not capping out and, f and frigging up my stream. So apparently there's an enhance here. I don't know where though. Hi, who are you? Welcome. All visitors are by appointment only, I'm afraid. Oh. Uh. Infinity is huge. Infinity is huge. What's this? I feel under What's Outland? Well, you're only as safe as your equipment out there. I'll show you my Welcome equipment. To Outland. We deal in only the finest, most reliable gear for whatever adventures may await you. All of our products come highly recommended by individuals who have devoted their lives to distant travel. And while I've never needed them myself, I stand by everything we offer. So you just fly out there buck naked? I'm impressed. Hmm, no, no flying for me. Not... not my style. You get a lot of repeat customers? I do. In this line of work, it's essential, don't you think? Not seeing people come back would not only suggest that they're not satisfied with our business, but that whatever they purchased had failed, hey, leaving Zeria. them unable to return. Yeah, yeah, it's weird. If I thought that were the case. Yeah, I'm seeing people with no problems at all. And in fairness, I am using NVENC and VTube Studio, but this game should be leaving, especially at 60 frames at 1440p, should be showing or leaving more than enough uh, headroom for me to do those things. Mr. Chinchilla, thank you for the 52 months. Thank you, thank you. Do I have my NVENC settings maxed out? Uh, I don't know, maybe? 
Shouldn't really matter. What you got for sale? Yes, by all means. Like, my, my point is more that this game shouldn't be using 90-something percent to hit 1440p at 60 frames per second. Wait, why is this... Why is this place so high-end? It just looks like trash. It's all poop. It's all poop! Who gives a fuck? Hmm. You've never been to space? Goodness, no, I just couldn't. You're out there millions of miles away from anything, and if something goes wrong... I can't stomach the thought. I prefer solid ground under my feet at all times. And preferably a hot, fresh coffee within reach. Can't get those in space either. Be careful out there. I guess if space travel was completely normalized, there'd be a lot of people... I guess it would become like camping, which I don't like. Like you, you, you would, you would just be like, yeah, no, I don't want to go to space. Where are all my creature comforts? Oh my god, I'm this guy. <laughs> yeah, I'm really, I'm really hoping that they, uh, they release AV1 support on Twitch because I feel like you do have to thrash your hardware kind of hard to make up for the fact that the bitrate is terrible. Also, what is the weather? Hello. <sighs> Sanctum Universum, don't need that. I need... Yes, exactly. It's like... like... When someone insults you, you want to just... beat the shit out of them sometimes. <laughs> uh, but you don't. <laughs> well, not quite what I was thinking, but that's actually a good Hello. example, Marcus. Hello. Crazy Star Collective. I don't want Crazy Star Collective. Never I want. Never forget. Never. What's it called? What was that place called where I can completely redo my appearance? Just tell me how many zeros I need to add to the offer. I'm sorry, sir, but in hunts, oh, you see citizens only. Ah. <laughs> I think I understand. And uh, the cost to put me down as a citizen would be... Welcome to Feeling Realty. I'm Zora, and I'm here to help with whatever you may need. What brings you in today? Looking to settle down or oh, move up housing. in the world or just window shopping? Uh, I just wandered in. That's fine. It happens all the time. I never mind an opportunity to chat with someone new. I'm here if you have any more questions, or if you'd like to look at properties. I'd like to hear about what you have on sale. Okay, let me just pull up your data. Oh... No... I I'm sorry, but you're not a United Colony citizen. I'm afraid property ownership here in New Atlantis isn't available to you. How do I become a citizen? Yes. If you take the exciting step of becoming a citizen, we'll be here for you. How do I become a citizen? I, I want to become a citizen. Stop by any time. You think this will burn me? Yep. Sizzled a little bit. Oh, I don't know if you've heard, but my sister started her own homestead. I'm not very good at this whole finding my way around thing. I just, I just wanted to find, I just wanted to find enhance. How do I enhance myself? Ah! That's it. I'm not going to I've not forgotten my objective. I, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I just want to do this first. I can't believe the UC just brought us off. Uh, 
like your cloak. Bobby mentioned he met you. UC just wrote he us off like that. Quite the adventure. They were gonna give our son to a different family. What? We made it back just in time. He's quite something, our Bobby, isn't he? Hi, Bobby. Hey, it's you again. Who the fuck are you? Who do you mean it's me again? Who is this? Why do they remember me? <laughs> it's me again, I guess. I honestly don't remember who you are. Bobby. Bobby Katz? No. Jeez. I heard old people lose their memories. <laughs> These are my parents. I told everyone they just got on a different shuttle, but nobody would listen. But I don't know We're who you are. Atlantis. What the fuck are you we talking have about? A new apartment. This place is amazing. Who are anyway, you? It's nice to see you again. Maybe I'll see you around. And don't forget my birthday. It's June 11th. He was there when I first visited. He was waiting for his parents and other people thought they were dead. Did I did I talk to him? I don't remember this fucking kid we're at all. Give our son to a different family. We made it back just in time. He's Bobby, remember? No, no, I don't remember. <laughs> Should you really be spending this much time talking to a kid? <laughs> I didn't talk to him. Then how the fuck does he know who I am? I'm being gaslit by the game. <laughs> There's Terra Brew. Maybe it hides us up there. Hello there, dear friend. <laughs> hey. Voice, your stature, your confidence. You strike me as a fellow collector. He was at the bottom of the steps at the spaceport when I first. I don't remember him at all. I absolutely did not talk to that kid. What do you do? <laughs> me? Uh, why, to be frank. But your I name don't is George. Much. Not anymore, <laughs> at least. and that suits me just fine. Yes. I now <laughs> live to collect artifacts from Earth. You see, every artifact tells a story. Ooh. Even spoons and forks, which most people, <laughs> laugh people laugh at me when they see I collect old Earth spoons. But think about it, friend. Spoons change the course of history. Oh, Eltheria, thank you so much for the them? sub. Thank you, thank you. That's very kind. Welcome aboard. Thank you very much. And full Sangatsu, thank you for the 65 months. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> I'm glad. <laughs> You're subbing for the joke. Hell yeah. Glad you appreciate. Ah, uh, the usual things, I suppose. Fame, fortune, power. Hmm. <laughs> Hell More yeah. More joking, of course. I've actually been fortunate to call New Atlantis home for many years. For a collector, like myself, I do believe there's no better place in all the Settle systems. I've been charmed to make the acquaintance mm. of many fellow Old Earth enthusiasts here in New Atlantis. And that is why I continue to stay. Okay, bye. Now where is in Hans? Welcome to Whetstone. The fuck is Whetstone? If you're looking for the best cut of meat in the settled systems, <laughs> look no further. Why wouldn't you? Baguette. Uh, Chandra Cabernet Sauvignon. Chandra Pinot. Is it Pinot pino, pino, pino Noir? I don't remember how to pronounce that. <laughs> No, penis. <gasps> Whoa, that looks nice. Yeah, the trailer for some of their new product. 
Okay, I'm starting to not believe that Enhance is here. Is there? I think I got them, uh... uh what do you call them? Corns? <laughs> Why do they yeah, keep telling me these corn. things? Bye! There's an Enhance on Mars? Yeah, but it said there was one here. She she told me. She she told me that there was one here. I'm gonna be a free star you can't go in. You just can't. But David's my friend. He writes me. I hate to break it to you, but his PA is the one who signs all those cards and headshots. Mr. Barron's a very busy and important man. But I came all this way. Uh, listen, I might be able to hook you up with some merch. It's next door to the coffee Maybe get place. You a to a oh, okay. Gig he's got. That's all I can do. You are the best. Wait, like, but, but that's just sitting out in the middle. What do you mean next door? Go right. This is infinity. Oh, <gasps> is this it? Jesus, you can barely read what that says. It says enhance though. How can I help you be the best you possible? Hi, welcome to Enhance. Thanks so much for stopping in today. <laughs> I'm sure my staff and I can accommodate your every need. If you're here to try something new or on a whim, or to replicate a look you've seen and loved elsewhere, or just want to love your reflection in the mirror a little bit more, we've got you covered. All our services and records are private and confidential, so no need to worry. Uh... Okay. What can we do for you today? Yeah, you can just recustomize. That's cool. Wait, if I don't change a particular thing. No, 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 no. Wait, where's the name change, chat? Can I name change? At the end? Okay. Chat, I swear to fucking god. It didn't even look slightly like Vinny. What do you mean? <laughs> Some... I get in here and I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna give myself some cute hair and then I end up hating everything. My kingdom for hair mods? Like, holy shit. <laughs> I need them. They hurt me.
You like the vanilla hair? Hmm. I don't want to adjust my cheeks slightly. But this is down versus up. I I don't I don't see how that Oh that was scale. Oh I see. That's that's what I meant. Get the bluefish look. <laughs> Each is a default human. Um, this is one of the defaults. I just kind of like tweaked her slightly. And now I'm fucking around with her again. I don't really understand the shape blend system. So I'm just using these ones up top. I thought there was a Starfield UI mod already. Am I losing it? I thought I saw one. Cheeks, too! Because apparently Ferret is actually a name that they will say. So, we'll see, I guess. Wait, wait, wait. This is the guy you saying looks like Vinny? Chat, are you blind? <laughs> Enhance will be here anytime you'd like a different look. <laughs> he has a beard! Oh my god! Oh god, my character's doing that, that, that stare thing. Oh dear. Look, look, she's doing it! She's doing the stare! <laughs> Hey, bro, I think you messed up my plastic surgery. Am I okay? <laughs> I'm seeing, like, weird ghosting on it as well. Hold on. Oh, yeah. The game's gone all weird, weird and jittery. Let me see. it starts with that preset. It's immersing me because of my messed up eyes. Oh, Wait, what am I tracking here? I don't understand why it's tracking two different places now. I mean, you can tell. I'm using the version with frame gen because it says use frame gen. <laughs> Chocolate will wake me up.
We say Starfield, but actually it's been New Atlantis Field for now. I ended up down here to go and do the constellation thing and got distracted. Always good to see another batch. Oh, is that why they're so friendly with me? Because I did a couple of UC security uh, quests? Well, that's unexpected. Powering down that junction doesn't show any other connections. Clearly, the source must be inside that residential tower. Yeah, that would make sense. You know, I think I remember seeing a report about power problems on one of the upper floors. I bet it's related. See if you can get up there. Hello? Okay. Apparently, apparently, I'm just breaking in now. It's fine. Supposed to tell, dude. <laughs> okay. Just get good, sweet. <laughs> Genuinely, though, I don't know how I'm supposed to tell if I'm gonna get, like, coaxed into a snafu like that. Thank you. Do I have coffee? Probably, but I, I don't like coffee. Set up all four before you put any in? Oh, god. But I can barely see back there. Thank you so much for the raid! Welcome, welcome, everyone! We hope you have a great time! Thank you, thank you! Hello, hello, how are you? Okay, I think that's it. Sneaky, sneaky. You like short hair and glasses, Laimu? Thank you. I think, I think, I think short hair is definitely my favorite look, and then glasses is just so good. Am I enjoying the game more now? I wasn't not enjoying the game. Are you getting me mixed up with someone else? Why am I so short? My mother made me that way. Oh, you mean the performance issues? Um, yeah, I managed to fix the thing with the CPU. I got DLSS installed so that my GPU is having an easier time. So, yeah, fix most of it. Uh, program says pause, current slicing target, ATM train, tra trans fee, location New Atlantis, slicing value 0 0.001 credits per transaction. Oh, <gasps> they are hackering. 
Uh, my guys got creative with the rewiring. You should have all the juice you need to run the program nonstop, so stop messaging me and get to work. I expect my cut soon. Keep the damn door locked. Last thing we did is someone poking around. Even if Gal, Bunk not notice Gal Bank notices the missing funds, they won't have a way to trace it. They'll call it a malfunction and wipe the records like they always do. Money's all digital anyway. They can literally just make as much as they want. Yeah, I haven't had a crash yet, but I'm making sure to save as much as I can. But yeah, as you can see, I do occasionally get stutters. And those actually only started happening since I installed the DLSS mod, but as the other alternative is uh, my stream lagging out so much the chat gets slideshowed, I'll go with this. If Lamu went bald, would the ears fall off? That's like saying if you shaved your dog, would their ears come off? <laughs> It ain't how it works. Chat, chat, why are you fighting? I want a secret ship. My tank sprung a leak. I'm stuck. And the only place close enough to land. Wait. You're not suggesting. Tolaman 2. Terrible. Did I just hear Hanzo from Overwatch? Sit down, grab the highest caliber weapon I've got, and start walking. Boom. If that had actually happened, nope. you wouldn't be standing here. <laughs> so His voice went all funny as I left. Another day? Bonna's so nice. stuff with that boost pack got enough flight traffic as it is i feel like you i should just help louisa anything, don't you because she's just nicer whereas where zoe has been kind of condescending as fuck so you tracked it down you've got something to show for it here you go great i'll get this back to mass for analysis i'm not stupid i know zoe probably made you an offer i appreciate that you didn't take it and You're I'm welcome. Really glad we got to work together on this. You think she want to kiss? So, it looks like maybe someone thought they could hack into Galibank's system. In fact, it looks like maybe they did. Still want to claim you had nothing to do with this, Zoe? My dear, why in the world would I want to break the law? And Galbank, no less. I do quite enough business with them <laughs> as it is. All right. Well, I'll have some people look over this. Maybe they'll be in touch. I very much doubt that. See you around. No, oh, they didn't kiss at the end chat. Pardon. Virtual light, thank you for the 27 months. Thank you very much. Okay, quick, quick, quick. Let's go talk to... Sarah. Once I have a companion following me, how do I tell them to fuck off I'm back to the be ship? A big time space pilot someday. Gonna have my own ship, my own crew. 
You don't know? How am I supposed to stealth once they start following me? <laughs> You're listening to the Settled Systems News. May yeah, maybe Sarah's just like mandatory because it's like tutorialized. Our whole office is getting moved to Gagar. Really? Yeah, this place was unplayable before, so definite improvements. That's kind of where my brain went to, Cal. Don Gaga? Feel free to help yourself at the bar. I don't drink, but this. I feel like if I did this, I hope this. you are satisfied. Nope, nope. Parents are just here. Available to you. I assumed it was all right <gasps> to let your parents in here. They finally said something about it. Stay for long. <laughs> They're like, your please. Your father by. He left a note for you. Here. Oh, note from dad. What's dad got to say? If you could stop by at home, there's something I wanted to talk to you about. Nothing urgent, but I sure would like to see you. But he's here. Deb, you want to talk now? Sounds I hope you don't mind, but I figured the lodge was just a nat stop away. I just had to see it. Oh, this place is everything I imagined. Do you know I dreamt of joining Constellation when I was a girl? Uh, you have hidden depths, Mom. I don't know if I go that far. But I'll let your father talk before he bursts. I was playing poker with the Dean of Engineering, and he had this collectible revolver oh. framed. And when he heard you were in Constellation... Minette, thank you well, for the two months. together to get the piece clean and Thank restored. you, thank you. He gave she me a gun? She beautifully. <gasps> we, uh, uh, took turns sighting it at the range. I swear, your father was acting like a school kid. <clears throat> Thank you, As Mina. I was saying, may I present to you Sir Malcolm Livingston's personal sidearm. Wow! Thanks, All the Dad. All modifications, just as he left him. He was chair of Consolation about uh, fifty years ago. Anyway, it's yours. Love you, Dad. I don't know what to say. I'll treasure it. I hope it keeps you safe. If not, maybe get a good place for it on a mantle. Well, we'll let you get back to it, but uh, Miss Noel said we could look around a little first. <laughs> Let's go have a look at this gun. Uh... Sir Livingston's pistol. Oh, damn. <laughs> it actually does a lot of damage. Look at it. Dude, if I could shove a silencer on this... Hmm. I don't know where to put it, though. I got too many guns now. <laughs> Ms. Noel, would it be all right if I brought cookies next time? Ah! Actually, Mr. Cookies, what type? I make a mean snickerdoodle. Yes, What's a snickerdoodle? I um, think that would be quite all right. I am at your service, Captain. <sighs> you said he would call me Ferret, but he's not calling me Ferret. Captain, now yeah, that he's not saying it anymore. Constellation, I am at your service. No additional protocols necessary. Also, he said he knew given Ferret. the likelihood that you will be out in unsettled space, it might be beneficial to go over exploration lighting. outpost development in case you ever need to build a base for field research. 
Starfield, Vesco, names list all. Yeah, Farid is listed. I am perplexed. Misspelled? You think I misspelled ferret? The exploration of an unknown planet can be a major undertaking. By building an outpost, you will be able to construct scanning equipment, resource extractors, <laughs> and defenses. It is even possible to set up multiple outposts capable of manufacturing, allowing you to build advanced equipment. Uh, what kind of advanced structures could I build? The scan booster is the most obvious, as it will enable you to detect landmarks and other points of interest from further away. Beyond that, extractors will allow you to collect raw materials of various types, while fabricators enable the manufacturing. A particularly prosperous outpost may even warrant the construction of cargo links, allowing you to share resources between other outposts you have built. So, like, you can just fuck off and start building outposts on weird barren planets and, and creating, like, a materials production line if you want to? A planetary scan will reveal the presence of key inorganic resources, although rarer elements will be harder to find without training and while a scan may detect the presence of life on a planet you will have to analyze the native plants and animals yourself to know what compounds they produce hey the blueprints you need to construct an outpost should already be on your watch it will automatically So is this just a Bethesda game in space? Yes, because it is a game made by Bethesda about space. <laughs> you must bear it. My primary function has been to support and protect Barrett during his travels. I am currently unable to do so. That is as capable as I can be of missing anyone. I believe uh -oh. Barrett would find your question amusing. Protecting Barrett must have been quite the challenge. Barrett has, thus far, survived every mission on which we have embarked. It is therefore evident that my efforts have been successful. Mm -hmm, I suspect mm -hmm. that Barrett would disagree with how necessary my intervention has been in any given situation. <gasps> Moonlit Butterfly, thank you for the sub! Thank you so much! Welcome, welcome! Ever since I got here... This has felt like home. Ready like to get out there? I hope it feels that way for you too. <laughs> Did she just kind of just go? Hi. <laughs> she she just like slowly brought her thing up and made like per like heavy eye contact with me. She's very pretty. I'm ready. We're going to be doing some old fashioned detective work. The artifacts are relatively inert once they're out of bedrock. That means people can pass them around, not even knowing what they are. I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects. Get back a lot of noise, usually. But a tip from the UC Vanguard sounds promising. Uh... The UC Vanguard? A volunteer force that helps defend the edges of United Colonies space. They're always looking for recruits. Lots of retired veterans and dangerous professionals mixed in with part-timers who barely have a laser cannon welded to a hull. My contact is in the recruiting office, so he hears The Outer Worlds stuff the was weird, because, like, I feel like everyone wanted Outer Worlds to be, like, New Vegas again so badly that they kind of just, like, got carried away with the hype when the game initially came out. Like, everyone was like, this game is perfect! 10 out of 10! The most amazing thing in the world! And then, like, after the first planet, I found that game incredibly meh. 
Other people have artifacts? We have to assume that we're not the only ones to have stumbled into this mystery. But most people aren't going into space looking for the unknown. They're looking for places to settle, resources to extract, territory to defend. An odd-looking rock or a single strange hunk of metal wouldn't mean much to them. That's why a constellation exists, in a way. To put pieces like this together. Uh, I'm excited. No. Good, a chance to learn You're more about the colonies. you your me already. Oh, well, good. We all need our own reasons to be out there. But it's not just that. I want to take Do you kind of feel like she's trying to, to seduce me? Handle yourself, and for you to learn more about us. I'm going to be sticking with you for this. We'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact or this lead runs dry. We'll need to head to Mast. Check in with the Vanguard recruiting office where my contact works. And listen, whatever you were before or whatever you do once you're out there, I don't care. So long as you don't bring UC security to our doorstep. Every Wait, this game this game actually has fucking conscience. I was making a joke. You can you can I I don't know how I feel about romancing Bethesda NPCs. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Constellation has a roster of members who haven't always been on the right side of their respective society. We're it's off screen, takers. right? Right, but you Some romance of us have seen them. A jail cell more than once. Oh no! If you join us, it means you're committed to our. Do mission. you remember how weird exchange, people got about like the you latitude in your choice of means? The lady NPCs in Skyrim. One of the most uncomfortable videos I've ever watched was someone talking about like this VR mod. That they had that allowed you to like interact more more uh realistically with npcs and they were being so weird about it like they they had like all of the female npcs had you know one of those those mods that just made <laughs> they just look like they were about to go onto a catwalk right and he was in vr and he was like look I feel like we're having an intense conversation and such a connection and I can reach out and I can touch her cheek and he like reached out with his VR hand and caressed this NPC and then at one point he like grabbed the you top of her head it. and moved her around and then on another part he like kept trying to grab her hands and the the NPC was just trying to do like her walk cycle so it kind of looked like she was trying to fucking escape. <laughs> the entire thing made me so goddamn uncomfortable, but nobody was saying anything about it in the comments. <laughs> and it was, it was just so weird. Yeah, he was talking about how immersed he was and how, like, at one, yeah, like at one point he talked about how you could see the soul in the eyes of the NPC because of the realism. And I was just like, <laughs> anyway, imagine that, but with actual NPC romancing. <laughs> okay. Good. Let's take a little stroll through New Atlantis, shall we? But yeah, they all have like, you know, you know when mods just like think, okay, in order to make eyes super, su Ask super realistic, we should give them like Speak shimmer if you have ideas. And, and make them look wet. Here. But they kind of went overboard and all these like NPCs looked like they wanted to fucking burst into tears, which I guess considering what he was doing is understandable. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe maybe these NPCs are better about it, but but those the NPCs always make me laugh because they just don't quite feel like they're. I, I don't know. I, I just get images of like trying to romance someone from Skyrim or something. Uh, where am I going? Oh, mast, right? Refund you the last two minutes of your life? No. Sarah, good to see you. Who's your you got down here fast? Holy shit. Hopefully Constellation's newest member. Thought I'd run What what if do you think I can have a conversation where I try to uh, sleep with this NPC and then like hey, I stop talking and like Vanguard? midway through the I'll the romance conversation she's credits. just like trying to get my attention back now that they start doing that? 
<laughs> just staring at each other and the NPC is like, hello? What creature? Ferret! Ferret VTuber. Did I do the horizontal tango? No, I've been dicking around doing like odd jobs on New Atlantis. Uh, I'd love to join the Vanguard. Excellent. Just need to do a little paperwork. An orientation on the UC, a knock out an exam, and a probationary mission. We need to know you'll be able to hack it out there after all. Do well. You'll be out there keeping the peace in no time. Don't forget, John. I need her How do you think I become a... Wrap her in that fancy get-up of yours. How do you think I become a citizen? Don't worry, Sarah. I'm not forgetting about you or our little business afterwards. Promise. Yes. First things first. Head down to the orientation. Yes. I'm listening. The registration terminal. Do you mind if I ask you some personal questions? Sure. Go ahead. You got a bounty? Well, oh, she's smiling at me. Right with the UC. Uh, is there anything you like to do for fun besides exploring? I can get you some exploration is my entire life. I consider it both a career and recreation. That being said, I will make a confession, but you have to promise to keep it between us. Before I graduated from school, I was in a band. And no, I don't mean the school band. I mean a rock band. <gasps> we called ourselves Ironic Comet. <laughs> A ridiculous name, I know. But uh, we were just a bunch of teenagers getting together and having fun. And before you ask, no, I wasn't the lead singer. I actually played the drums. Okay, Gwen. The band never really went anywhere, of course, but those were good times, and I remember them fondly. <laughs> what do you consider your areas of expertise? Actually, my dad just recently posted up a bunch of pictures of him in the band when he was 15. Do you want to see them? It also, it makes, it makes me laugh because, like, you know how a lot of the time people in older photos don't look like what we would perceive to be that age? My dad does not look 15 in these photos. <laughs> he looks like 20-something. <laughs> don't dox my dad. I'm not gonna dox my dad. Hold on a second. I'm gonna... Obscure the name of the band. Not that you would be able to find it. <laughs> Open. You all, everybody. You all, everybody. Ba -da 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 -da. It is such a good fucking photo, though. Holy, holy shit. Uh, let me see. <laughs> I don't look very much like my dad, unfortunately. The only, I think the only thing I really got from my dad was maybe the fact that my hair is curly. Hmm. Here you go. <laughs> Which one do you think is my dad? <laughs> All those dads! <laughs> it actually took me a minute to recognize him. Which is quite... I mean, I guess he was 15. That's pretty different, right? The one on the right... No, my dad is the one with his arms folded, standing right next to the truck. On, like, in the blue jacket. <laughs> you got it right? Awesome. You were just typing yellow shirt? <laughs> there are multiple blue jackets? Yes, but I just said the one with his arms folded, standing right next to the truck in the blue jacket. There's only one person that matches that exact description. <laughs> There's two? That's not right next to the truck! <laughs> the, one, the one immediately beside the truck, closest to... <laughs> with the dog hair and the yellow shirt, not redhead. <laughs> Why are you like this? Yeah, there's a guy on the ground. <laughs> uh, 
It's not a truck, sorry. Van. Whatever that is. <laughs> They're all Vinny. <laughs> but yeah, that's, it's very, it's very like, 70s-ish, isn't it? <laughs> Who were the others? No idea. You pretty sure it's Ron Weasley on the ground? Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're apparently all 15 and 16 here, which is just like, what the fuck? <laughs> Da -da, da -da -da -da. But yeah, that's that's my dad's band. <laughs> the guy, the guy, like standing right by the truck, he looks quite young. Yeah. You mean, apart from being the chair of Constellation for the past five years? Well, let's see. I pride myself with my aptitude for astrodynamics, calculating optimal trajectories for grav jumping. Nerd. That's been quite useful in the past. And as far as planetary exploration, my area of expertise is botany. Nerd. So, don't worry. I won't let you eat anything that might put you in the hospital. <laughs> <laughs> Religious beliefs? My parents considered themselves to be enlightened. But their lives were so busy, they rarely pursued their beliefs. By the time I was old enough to start questioning these things, the idea of following any organized religion was almost an afterthought. It's not that I don't want to believe in anything. It's that my scientific mind is often at odds with my spiritual center. Having been out there... In the star field. She said that they're seeing all those magnificent wonders with my own eyes. I need answers, not religious theory. I'm sorry if that disappoints you. But don't worry. While we're on this journey together, I fully intend to respect your religious beliefs. I have no religious beliefs. Bye. Certainly. I always enjoy our little chats. She does sound more like the person that's like uh Maybe talking about time. in is it Hitman? I don't think it is. What can I do for you, applicant? Uh Right. Got so wound up bringing you on board, I almost forgot. <laughs> oh, I haven't. Hello, Trace. Come on, John. Let's hear it before you try to convince her to join the Marines. All right. Here's what I've got. Vanguard volunteer by the name of Moera. Helps patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. Sweet Tweet was in here. Which admiral did he upset he tried to, to escape. get that posting? He's Martian, born and raised. Not like I can get anyone else to care. Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. Matches that description Sarah gave me. Um... Oh, he goes way back. I think it was recruit number 81 or something. Oh, that's interesting. Wait, they were doing a countdown to launch? Huh. Neat. Okay. What's wrong with the soul system? Are you kidding? Lowest posting request rate in the whole fleet. Only thing there the UC cares about is Mars. And no one wants to go to Mars. They want to get off Mars. So, I forget that the whole thing in this world is basically everyone left Earth, Earth went extinct, and now the entirety of the soul system is just basically considered a wasteland? That sucks. <laughs> soul system is a lot of planets, but a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sidonia on the regular. Earth! Earth! You mean hitting the bars, don't you, John? Hey, nothing wrong with a little refresh between patrols. Can you tell me about Sidonia? Yeah, bring a coloring book. You get so used to seeing red, you'll forget what blues and greens look like. Better than brown. Uh, thank you for all your help, John. Anything for Sarah. Honestly, I'd like to see a planet that isn't just, like, own. brown and gray. Even the prodigal children. Oh, brother. Are there any planets that are lush and green in Starfield? I would like to find one. Yeah. <laughs> 
I mean, I had I had like on my first couple of streams, I did spend like I don't know twenty minutes making a dick out of objects. So I I can't claim to be taking this game super seriously. <laughs> Okay. Now, how do I go back to my ship? Is there a go to ship button? Yeah, I think this mission is probably decent to do because it's like a tutorial type thing. I've flown across most of the settled systems in all manners of spacecraft, and yet I still get sick on the gnat. You can use the hand scanner. Cool. But just quickly, can I put a weapon bench on my ship? Like, I don't want to fully upgrade it, but can I just, like, plonk a weapon bench module in here? Got anything you need to offload? Hey, what can I do for you? Okay, no problem. Okay. Uh. Armory hab? How do I add an armory hab? Well, looking at the parts go left and the right on the... In here? That's all I got. Shipbuilding? Oh, add. G. Jesus Christ, that was small. Alright, here we go. Here we go, we're getting there. Structural... Bays? Landing bay. <laughs> I tell you what. This is this is not my thing. Also, it's Q and T to scroll between menus, which is awful. Engineering bay? Armory? I'll need a new engine because I'm going to be overweight. You know what? I'm just going to wait till I find a weapon bench. I don't care. <laughs> I'm going... No, I'm going to find a new ship and it's going to be a great ship and I'm just going to use that ship. There's a weapon bench in the basement of the constellations. Motherfucker. Okay. <laughs> oh, off I go. Hey, we're back again. Don't give me that look. <laughs> Listen, I'm trying my best. Much as I'm no. eager to explore the universe. There's nothing quite like the feeling of returning home. 
<gasps> Stuff! Things! Pharmaceuticals! I love those! <laughs> I can't move my mouse properly because I spilled water on my mouse mat, so now there's drag, and I'm sad. Wait, I need muzzle mods? Come on, come on. God damn it. I can't put suppressors on by myself. Boo! Does it take a lot to actually start modding anything? <laughs> it does have a suppressor, it's just I like to customize my stuff. Yeah, I need rank one of weapon engineering. Which... Oh my god! <laughs> I need like at least five more levels. Good. Ooh. Yeah, I guess I guess unless you're wanting to hard commit to science, then you're mostly just going to be like purchasing or finding weapons. to be back on board. Oh yeah. I thought for a second he was gonna say space the final frontier. I was gonna get mad. Uh... Oh. For some reason the first time I press R, or hold R to grab jump, it doesn't let me. I played a small amount of Silent Hill 3. It's actually one of those games that I, I, I bitched out of. I found it so much more scary than 2. You got your limo sticker in the mail? Ta-da! We've arrived! <laughs> that makes me very happy to hear. I hope
hope you enjoy it. I hope it's I hope it's good quality. I saw it was really big. Oh, that reminds me of what I need to do. Um uh our Chippy. Is Chippy around? Hey Chippy! Hey Chippy! I don't wanna mess up I don't wanna mess up your um your your channel settings. Could you make a merch post uh channel in Discord so people can post the things that they get? You know, for when the merch finally arrives, but stickers for now. Yeah, like merch photos. <sighs> There? Oh, Jesus. She's trucking. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what it was. I think it was like the loud noises. Because <laughs> I don't really find Silent Hill 2 scary at all anymore. I don't know. Maybe I should try and play it again. How big is Limon? Uh, his body fits the span of my hand, and then his head's like additional. Suppose that would explain the brownouts. So, what's this going to run? If there are no other surprises, mid five figures. Building Sidonia completely underground was a clever way of keeping the city shielded from the harsh Martian landscape. How big are my hands? Not big. Where should you put your limo sticker? Mmm. Across the center of your monitor. <laughs> uh, I don't know. PC case? Desk. Have I touched the ship customization? No, I, I I touched. Well, sorry, I touched it, and I immediately got gummy ship flashbacks and decided I hated it forever, and ran away. We run a tight ship here on Sidonia. Yeah, I'm gonna save scum for pickpocket points. Sorry. Well, they learn never to do it again. Just because the governor's office is right there on the main level doesn't mean it's not secure. Yeah, it does. Oh. <laughs> Hi! Welcome to Sidonia Security. I'm Commander Vincent Woodard, Chief of Planetary Security and former head of the Red Devils program here on Mars. <laughs> I tend to deal with security at a high governmental level. Sarah? Whereas my associate Booth over there handles day-to-day -day security issues. So if you're looking to report a minor crime or misdemeanor... You're, you're making me very uncomfortable. Him. But if there's something I can help you with, feel free to ask. Still do, technically. I'm a naval commander. But they've got me here pushing pencils ever since the Red Devils disbanded. I pulled double duty, aiding in recruitment, and serving as the Sidonia security chief, representing the UC. If you ask me, though... I have hot chocolate. Nothing's been the same since the Red Devil's glory days. Very nice. Thank you, Chippy. Uh, Red Devils, what's that? Only the finest bunch of soldiers to ever grace the UC with their service. Of course, I may be biased as a Red Devil myself and head of the program. Well, former, I should say. Program's been defunct since the armistice that ended the colony wars. It put a stop to any and all Xeno warfare. I fought to keep them operational here, but the top brass concluded that without their unique alien bioweapon training, there was no need for a separate elite soldier program. Did you ever think about starting up the Red Devils again? All the goddamn time. <laughs> It's been about 20 years. I mean, they didn't but announce the, the Silent Hill remake that long ago, right? Desk, I size them up and wonder if they have what it takes to be a red devil. I'd give my left thumb to recruit fresh devils again. But it'd take nothing short of a miracle to convince the top brass to reinstate the program. What can you tell me about this city? It's small, it's dusty, it's old, but it's home. It may not be anything fancy, but I couldn't dream of living anywhere else. Bye for now. Bye. Ever been to Aquila? Oh, those security uniforms are way cooler than anything <laughs> we've got. I am super hidden right now. I'm detected right now. I'm super hidden. I'm detected. I'm super hidden. I'm detected. <laughs> Oh, it's that guy over there. What a dick. Sorry? What do you mean there's no work? 
Yeah, do you have any idea how far we've traveled? How's the saying go? How much no, no mercy, we leave no quarter. We were told there were drugs. Do your part to keep Sidonia graffiti free. Will do. Damn it. You're under arrest. No sudden move. <laughs> uh, night, Cleo. Sidonia graffiti free. UC security. Get back. Mother. UC security. Ow. Don't make any sudden moves. Do your part. Pickpocketing cops Sidonia is very bold. A little bit. You shouldn't have taken that from them. Why? Snitches get stitches, Sarah. <laughs> not not specifically, but the same button that I, that is used to uh, test tits to make sure it's working is also the button that uh, quick loads in this game. Self service bounty clearance. <laughs> Wait, so you you can just like it's so common for people to do crimes that they just have a self-service kiosk now. They're like, we don't want to deal with it. Just pay here and go and commit some more crimes. I know you were counting on that Sidonia hazard pay, but we'll find something else. True blue, thank you for the hundred bits. I don't think it works at that level. I actually I actually don't know though. It might have been that it disconnected. I don't think it disconnected. Hold on. No, no, it's been working. It's been working throughout the stream, right? What's the base level? Five, I think. So it, oh yeah, so it's equivalent to a sub. Ooh. So this is how I can make money? What? I like the red detonation. This man's name is Phil Hill. Let me know if you need something. I fell hill. Oh, hello there, friend. Why aren't you Have looking you at me? There long? Mm, you look tired. What? Oh, heavens no. <laughs> These bags under my eyes are just. Um, how I look? Okay, you got me. I, I am pretty tired, but but I can do this. But oh my, I've forgotten my manners. Are your eyebrows your okay? Service. Yes, it rhymes. My parents had a thing about rhyming. My siblings are named Phil, Jill, and Sill. The Hills. <laughs> what a thrill. But there I go again. <laughs> you aren't here to talk about me. You're here to talk about List. What's Sounds List? Like we're about to hear a sales pitch. Why do I say her like... Why did I just hear her through the radio? <laughs> This better not be some kind of timeshare pitch. What? No, no, nothing like that. I assumed everyone has heard about us by now. We're List, the League of Independent Settlers. Oh, they're the people How I just took a mission I help for. Make today your very best day. Ah! What does List do? Why, we help people. We get folks set up and able to start new lives and new places. Free I just want to reach out and grab people. his eyebrows and hold we them survey still. The stars, find suitable places matching people's needs, and get folks started with the essentials. I don't suppose you have a ship? Interested in earning some easy credits? You want to work for him, chat? It might mean we have to talk to him again.
<laughs> Not interested for now. Well, uh, that's unfortunate. Um, we're in, well, uh, desperate need of capable individuals to assist in our work. So if you'd like to learn more, please come speak with me again, okay? <laughs> Brian David Gilbert, not familiar. Fancy seeing you here. Ah, stop it! Keep it simple or keep to yourself. And everyone will be happy. Yes? He's not sneaky, what? I just I just think like the character is very overbearing. For over 40 years. Few places can offer that kind of stability. I heard about something called the Red Devils. Know anything about them? Only that I didn't care much for them getting disbanded years ago, and well, I don't care much for the rumors they're coming back someday. <laughs> I'm looking for a vanguard named Moara. He ain't been around. Went off on patrol. Hasn't been back in since. We're starting to think it might be time to pour one out to the blackest sea. The blackest sea? You got another word for it? He means outer space. Why do you sound well, like that? You're right there! <laughs> uh, we can track him down if you know his patrol route. Uh, believe me, I've heard it. After about round three or four... He does look like Dallas from Alien, about. yes. Oh, wait, no, He's sorry. I mean, he looks exactly like Vinny. Am I right? Look, nothing more I'd love than to help out a fellow Martian. Especially one that's missing. But... <clears throat> he has a tab, and you don't know if he's coming back. It's a lot of credits, okay? I let it slide for a long time because he's a regular, but... <laughs> if I'm out all that money... I got problems. What do you say? Mm. Your companion can speak on your behalf. What they will say is written next to their name. I mean, he seems like a fairly decent dude. But I kind of want to see her step in. <laughs> no, I've done this routine. Sarah Morgan Let's loved the that. You admit you're lying about what he owes. You call me a liar? I'll throw both of you out of this bar right now. <laughs> no, please. Two strangers arrive from Offworld asking for information only you have. You see an opportunity. Everyone Why are you in does. your spacesuit? Lower the price. Don't think we can't find another way to get what we want. Fine. <laughs> Agreed on a discount, right? Let me confirm the amount. What does her voice sound like Great. that? Because she's stuck in a spacesuit, but not really, Last I guess. Last time he was here, Moera kept yelling about the Lady of Love. <laughs> Singing songs. All that kind of thing. Venus? That's only one planet. Hardly an entire patrol route. I got what I got, okay? Fine. We'll make do. It's just one whole planet. How how big could it be? You think I should do this mission and get rid of Sarah before I do the deep cover mission? Probably. She might think it's kind of weird if I suddenly go off and start, like, infiltrating a weird faction. Whatever you'd like. 
I like how badly the skybox box glitches when I have this mod on. Oh god, it's bright. Fly into the sun. I don't know, I can't These move. Are a cluster of ships. Varun Zealots. You ever run into one? <laughs> Completely devoted to a deity they call the Great Serpent. The devourer of the unbelievers. I'll let you guess what happens if they spot us. I'm gonna shoot them. Uh why are they out here near Venus? No idea. They appear and attack people seemingly at random. Oh, thank Our you, Samuel. That's nice of you. Do you see Vanguard Moore ship no, anywhere? No other ship readings in the area. And I doubt they'd be so calm if a Vanguard had flown by recently. I don't I doubt they know where our Vanguard no, is. But I think I see something else that might. There's a UC satellite beacon hovering distressingly close to those Varun ships. If we can get close enough to it, we could download its logs and figure out where our Vanguard was heading to next. Hmm. So we need to get to that beacon without being attacked. Alternatively, murder! Easy. Three ships to our one. We cut down to minimal ship power and creep forward. They might not notice us getting closer. No! But yes, worst case, we fight our way through. Uh, to avoid detection systems like weapons and shields are easier to detect. For maximum stealth power, normal systems except one or two bars on your engines and stay far away from enemy ships as you can. Fine. I'll do your dumb tutorial. Oh, great serpent. Bless this communion that we may walk in Janan Verun's footsteps. That he why are they say why are they saying that into their calm system? Into the why am I veering off to the left? I'm crying and I'm screaming and I'm vigorously masturbating. Are we there yet? How far do we need to be? Wait, did she say 500 meters? It's gonna take forever. Hold on, I'm speeding up. <laughs> I feel really bad. Like, every time I sing that, there's like a bunch of people who haven't heard it before. <laughs> You can't just sing it? Alright, I guess we got time. Hold on. Let me just type vigorously masturbating into this Firefox. Is it this one? And I'm done. <laughs> My Lexi, thank you for the seven months. Thank you, thank you. And Kurt, thank you so much for the two months. Thank you both. And I'm 
I'm done. How am I finding songs like this? I'm pretty sure this one was Mountain Dew. This one was him, like, leading me into darkness. Da 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 This is Vagor Moira. To all you C affiliated ships, I'm heading to the Nova Galactic Storyard orbiting Earth's moon. Yeah, yeah, I know. The whole place is decommissioned. But I need parts for emergency repairs. Hopefully it hasn't been picked clean yet. Oh, that's not good. Earth and everything around it was abandoned a long time ago. <laughs> and the old star yards are crawling with spaces and other scavengers. Ow. Impact, thank you for the four months. Thank you very, very much. Anyway, now that I have stealthed... Gonna power up some weapons and shields. I'm gonna die. <laughs> How do I use my missiles? I don't remember. Holy shit, I'm dying horribly. <laughs> uh, they're mean. I don't like them. Ow, ow. I'm dead. Alright, fine. Fine. I learned my lesson. <laughs> Okay, so where am I going next? What was it, Earth's moon? I think I need a slightly better ship to fight them because they just trashed me. I know where the moon is, right? Yeah, it's by Earth! And where's Earth? What do you mean, where's Earth? Do you need a map? People still use their modules, even though their star yard hasn't been running in forever. Uh... I want to walk on the moon. Well, if you want to take a little detour, I admit I wouldn't say no. Just remember, <laughs> we need to find Vanguard Moara and that artifact when we're done. Uh, Star Station ships can be docked with allowing you to board them. You need to select the ship in your HUD and then fly to fly close enough so that the dock prompt appears. I like how she's just like, yeah, okay, let's go to the moon. <laughs> What's the gravity drive for? How do I go to the moon, chat? Aha, land. Walking on the moon. Da 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 Hey Mike Delta, how are you? It's good to see you. Have you been? Have you been? How did everything go with the art? Walking on the moon. Wait, extreme solar radiation? What? Oh no. Lots of work. I know that feeling. I'm so behind on like everything that's not just organization streaming stuff. I, my YouTube is horribly behind. It's awful. So, what exactly did we do to Earth? Is 
Isn't there a flag somewhere around here? Apparently there's like a fast way to drill stuff, but I don't know what it is. Old right click? Okay, I try. I'm gonna go touch that ship. Is the game fun? I think so, yes. Is it really necessary oh. for you to drag around all that gear? Rude, it's iron actually. I don't understand why every spaceship that I've or sorry, spacesuit that I found is worse than the first one. Oh, is it worse? It is. It's worse on the physical score, which I think is what's important when I'm fighting people. Why didn't I put all these on the ship? <laughs> lasers aren't physical? Well, I haven't been hit by a laser yet. Actually, no. Sometimes I do get hit by lasers. You're right. I mean, which one... Which one looks cooler? I mean, this has minus 15 incoming physical damage, so... Yeah, whatever. I could give it to her. Hold on. Come here. Wait. Okay, for a second I thought that ship was taking off. Sarah, come here. We still need to find any sign of dropping off a few choice items. <laughs> Until later. I like the high school backpack, it's cute. <laughs> yeah, the constellation backpack, for whatever reason, is much more valuable than everything else so far. Oh, wait, no, that's not a boost pack, so I can't use that. Wait, that's my ship. I just dropped my trash on the moon. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. <laughs> I mean, this place is apparently already a wasteland. Is some is someone gonna come by and 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 like give me a penalty for it? Should I expect a fine?
Earth's dead, chat. You know what I'm gonna do? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go everywhere and collect as much junk as I can. Then I'm gonna land on Earth and I'm gonna shit it everywhere. To spite you. It's locked. It's an advanced lock. Can I even get on here? <gasps> I've never done an advanced lock before. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Ow. Valentinius Anodyne, thank you for the entire year. Thank you so much. Yeah, of course. If you don't get fined, that means it was fine. <laughs> Am I so bad at this? Does anyone else keep expecting this to just break into like... Star Trek music or something? Okay, so those two are fitted. Wait, 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 wait. The more complicated the lock, is it the more, like... ...dud picks it gives you? That's stressful. I no longer remember which ones were good for the top part. <laughs> Uh, was this one and this one? Yeah, okay, so ignore these two. Six holes? You're six holes. Hey, that one does work. This one does not work, right? You're seven holes? <gasps> Wait, does this work? That's it, right? Success. Okay, one, two, Three... Four. <gasps> I have committed crimes. Whose ship is this? Oh, look, chat. Paste. Why is she crouching? Because we're stealth! What if I just take the whole ship? Is there even anything good in here? Whiskey. Wait, wait, wait. Is whiskey spelled with an E or not? Because sometimes I see people get really upset when, when it's spelled the way that they don't like it being spelled. Depends on where it was brewed. Oh. Wait, there's nothing here. <laughs> this ship sucks. Oh wait, there's a door. <gasps> so much room for activities. What if I took this for myself and filled it with benches? Hey, Sarah, you good? Mm. 
my ship. Oh, yep, yeah, this is this could be my ship. But wait, what do I do with my old ship if I steal this ship? It's just it's just on the moon now. You now have a new home ship. Your previous home ship is added to your fleet. To retrieve ships in your fleet that you've left behind, go to the ship services technician and ask to view the ships that you own. From there, you can cycle through the ships in your fleet and select make home ship to retrieve it. Huh. So, I don't drive, right? But there's a way that vehicle ownership works that if you find one that's not occupied and currently being used and you sit in it, it's yours now? Is that how it works with cars? <laughs> I see, I see. Yoink. Got a new ship. Ship, ship, ship. Oh, wait. Chat, my weapon sucks. Oh. Look, I only have par, eng, shid, and gurv. Happened to my own ship? I dished it on the moon. That is how it works with boats? I mean, I guess if you find a boat floating abandoned in the middle of the ocean, there's a much higher chance that whoever owned that boat is fucking dead. Versus, like, if you find a car parked in the side of the road. <laughs> like, I, I don't think you can be blamed for assuming that maybe someone might be dead. If you find an abandoned ship in the middle of the ocean versus the car scenario. It's totally the same? Oh, okay. <laughs> what if you find an abandoned... Oh, an abandoned car in the middle of the ocean? That's fair, then. That's two fair game. In, and we're already looking at a corpse. I wasn't even okay. two steps in. It's not Vanguard Moara. Looks like spacers were scavenging around here and someone else came in and said hello. Come sit with me. Oh, this won't be your last encounter with a spacer crew. They pillage abandoned facilities and shoot anyone who gets in their way. They're even less organized than the Crimson Stop Fleet. rolling your eyes Just at her! countless <laughs> desperate groups scavenging and killing to survive. I didn't even think you could get to another planet if you travel without fast travel. Lab and see if you find a plane abandoned in the middle of the sky. <laughs> I mean, if you can James Bond your way onto it, I don't think anyone would contest your ownership. This gun looks very s silly and small in my big armored hands. But so you can actually fly? It just felt like I wasn't getting anywhere, so I just stopped. That's cool, though. Why can I not throw things at people? Like... The me now The mechanism for lifting stuff up and throwing it is like really janky. Do you think if I fire a gun at an oxygen tank, I'll blow up? Hmm. <laughs> 
Naranai, thank you for the 107 months. Holy frig, that is a long time. Thank you so very, very much. You are getting very close. Thank you. All right, more advanced luck picking. <laughs> okay, so the two that I used were... That one... And... <laughs> this one? Okay, yeah, so these two. So we can't use these two. Easy game, easy life. Uh oh. No, I used the wrong one! I think. Did I use the wrong one there? Shit, I think I didn't. Uh that one. And that one. Aha! If that was locked, there must be something they don't want us to find. Stealth. Thank you, welcome to Est. <gasps> Urban Eagle. 47 physical? <gasps> Gonna touch it. There are too many guns that I want to use. <laughs> Expensive. Hmm. Nine. Does it look cool? Yeah, boy. <sighs> she makes slurpy noises. Question, does this game... Or sorry, does this rifle count as suppressed for the purposes of my damage boost? Like, I know it's quiet, but when it says suppressed weapons, get a damage boost when you're hidden. What the fuck was that? There's a laser! Oh, it's fucking Sarah! Why is someone making very loud popcorn? Was oh, that people shooting? You're going to regret this. Oh, I don't have any ammo. <laughs> huh. Where do I get ammo for this gun, chat? That was an ecliptic mercenary. What are they doing here? Scavenging a laser. A bit low end for that. Holy shit. Get popped in the head. Cow. Is that a is that bullet or laser, do you think? That's glass, that's glass. Oh, what does this gun do? I'm gonna pop this person in the head with my gun. Hello? What do you mean you're gonna find me? I never left. Uh, whoop, 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 whoop. Pop, pop, pop. 
Make a motherfucker's drop. Pop. 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 This gun's busted. Anything useful? No. Ooh, sushi. I had sushi today. Wow, Limes, you had sushi? Daring today, aren't we? Ah, uh, that's trash. <gasps> Gray, thank you for the 70 months at tier two. Thank you, thank you. Sushi and hot chocolate streamer? <laughs> Stepping out of your comfort zone, I know. That looks like it could be good. What's a synapse? I wish I could see what something is before I pick it up, so if I know if I'm gonna actually care for it, if it's just gonna clog up my bags. Was that you? No. No, what? Oh! Hello? Don't let him get away! Okay. I love jam. Okay, I press R. You picked the wrong day to piss me off. You're shooting at the wall. I'm playing at uh, 1440p, and I still think that their name says epileptic, so... <laughs> oh, I can't shoot through there. That sucks. We over-encumbered? Honestly, I'm always over-encumbered in this game. It's ridiculous. Look, I got a laser thing. I'm Let's gonna, I'm gonna it. shoot it with it. Hold on. How does this work? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Of course it's not epileptic! Why would we be beefing with an organization called the Epileptics? God. <laughs> that would be fucked! <laughs> I'd be happy to carry a few things for you. <laughs> oh no. Okay, hold on. Uh... 
Oh, that one's better in every way than what I'm using. Oopsie daisy. Talk to you later. You like my casual attire? Thank you. I'm pretty pleased with it personally. Attacking epileptics with a beam of light. <laughs> you guys are fucked. So. Is it worth just, like, ma picking up boost packs en masse and, and selling them all? Because they seem fairly worth... I did just press R. I was just in the R menu. Did you not see? I pressed R. It was very good. They're not as good value to weight as guns. Okay, I pick up all the guns and sell them. Do you remember, like, how mad people got in during the island? Or no, the forest? When I hadn't gotten the map because I hadn't been caught or downed yet. And people were like, you're not pressing the M key correctly? Like, Strumer, you must be pressing M wrong. <laughs> and Streamer, you totally have the map. God, Streamer. They have anything valuable? Oh. I take this with me. But you know, holy moly, thank you for gifting seven subs. Welcome, everyone. Welcome, welcome. Thank you, let you know. Oh, lag. I felt so bad playing the forest because it was just like every time the game tried to take me or lead me anywhere It was just like, no, I'm gonna cut down 90 more logs There's nobody here The D forest <laughs> I also liked how you could just cheese the entire raid me mechanics by just sitting on your ship all night. Oh, there isn't even a local map in this one. Nice. I don't remember what we, we opted to do in the end. Did you guys, like, make me rescue that kid? It was so creepy and weird. I tried to kill him. No, he was already dead. Don't you put that on me. He was already dead. The options were continue the cycle and revive him or let him go. You tried to kill him. Why would I do that? Oh.
don't know why, Bestie, but what you just said kind of like made me flash back. Wasn't there like, was it a ship post song? Where it was like, Washington, Washington, six foot four, weighs a fucking ton? Is that a thing? I feel like that's a thing. I refuse to believe that I got caught there. I, I blame you. <laughs> it was on the autoplay? Oh. Does it have spicy words or can I go listen to it? I don't remember. <laughs> they say fuck? Oh, well, wow, that's just disgusting, really. That's fine. <laughs> I'm going to lick. What's it called? Oh, you got it? Thank you. Did you have that bookmark still? <laughs> Six foot eight. <laughs> Why did he just take a bite out of a of a of a reindeer? This video is very weird. <laughs> <laughs> Not the British children. I'm glad I'm glad that I was I'm glad that I was able to remember that this song existed. <sighs> Washington. Washington. <laughs> what? It's all real, a totally factual account of George Washington. I mean, I believe you. Being as I am not from America, I would not know. So I appreciate the education. Thank you. So the DLSS mod seems really good, but I have noticed that going in and out of menus and like starting movement again makes me makes me stutter. But it's still better than what I had before. And it's it's like it's like a very new release, so we we can forgive it, yes? What do I need for my, my rifle? Hold on, I'll have a look. Uh, old earth hunting rifle. I need 9 times 33 millimeter. Whatever the fuck that is. I like how getting shot in the head is can't concentrate. I mean, Sarah, I don't know what you expected there. Willa Donnie, thank you for giving the gift of stuff to Ivy Earth. Thank you, thank you. Come on. 
Holy shit! <laughs> They're beating on her with axes! Explain Reddit Double Dick Guy? No! I've done that before. You know what the Reddit Double Dick Guy is. You just want me to say Double Dick again. I like how they haven't found me yet. I'm stealth. Stealthing so hard right now. Oh no, it was a lie. Take much more of this. I just think it's it's absolutely hilarious. Sarah, no! <laughs> I can't take much more of this, she says before throwing herself over the barrier. No! <laughs> That's so much to live for. She's gone. Oh fuck, hey. Jesus, you're beefy. Hold on. But yeah, the guy was not content with pretending that he had two penises. It was just like over the course of like, what, half a decade or something? He kept making them bigger in like his photoshopped pictures. Like they started out as two like regular sized dicks. And by the end of it, he basically had like two horse cocks. It was ridiculous. <laughs> Like, imagine not being content in your lie, and you have to keep making it, like, more ridiculous. Oh, hi, Sarah. Welcome back. No, yeah, it was absolutely Photoshop. It was not real. Damn it. Go down. Taking damage. Uh. Do -do 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 -do. You got nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Wait, is she wearing the the pack that I gave her? I don't remember her having that before. Uh, didn't stock up on junk. The fuck? Uh, why is my watch red like that in the bottom left? It's usually white. Is it because I'm in danger? No, it was really funny that people chose to believe it because he would just show up and tell like absolutely absurd elaborate stories about ridiculous like threesomes that he would have that were just so they were they were just written like you know those really bad uh come on Amazon like porn novels they were just written like that with the most, like, absolutely unfeasible, physics-defying descriptions. Like, it was, like, bad erotica. And it was just, people were just like, yeah, this is totally real. <laughs> Man, it was fun when Unidan was the worst thing that ever happened to Reddit. I am of innocence. Hi, I love Laimu, how are you? No, I haven't, Easy Squeezy. Bestie is correct. What did Bestie say? I didn't see what Bestie said. Oh, I see. You don't understand, Gray. The guy on Reddit said it, so it must be true. All that junk you're hauling is seriously slowing you down. You worked at McDonald's and there was a guy in there who used to come place an order. You'd tell him how much and he would slap his dick on the counter? Like, more than once? That was allowed to happen more than once? <laughs> Why am I 
even here? Oh, I'm looking for that vanguard guy, I remember. Wait, did I just run past him because I was too busy murdering? I feel like that would have been a better prank to pull at Subway. You'd be like, hey, I'm here to order the footlong. And then... and then penis. What if it's not a foot long? Well, a six inch sub is perfectly valid as well. I need to go dump some of this stuff off on her. Hey. We still need to find any sign of Vanguard Moara. I'll only carry the good stuff. <laughs> Just kidding. Stop right Goodbye. now. Thank you very much. Need somebody with a human touch. Hey, you always on the run. Gotta slow it down, baby. Gotta have some fun. Do 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 and this ale, and this rye, and sandwich, and the snack pack, and the protein bar. And sushi rolls. Oh, I may have accidentally consumed too much booze. That's okay. Da -da -da -da. Da -da 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 da 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 Oh, wait, is that stove on? Oh, that's very dangerous. Hold on, let me. You're welcome. Ooh, toast. I don't want the plate, I wanted the toast. Yeah. Would you like toast? Put on Companion's head? Companions in this game seem to have like force fields- Or sorry, characters in this game have force fields around their head. It's very sad. I tried to put like a box on people's heads and it doesn't let you a lot of the time. <laughs> Wait, can I put this box on your head? Sarah, do you have a force field? <gasps> she doesn't- No, wait, she does. She, she kind of does. Hold on. Can I? How do I rotate it towards me? Is that a thing that I can do? Yeah, so far the only person I've been able to put a box on was like sitting down. I can't do anything but spinning around in a circle! Help! <laughs> Can I not turn it that way? This is bullshit. Yeah, no, I got like force fields or something. This is the worst day ever. Potato. I can cook? Whoa. Alien jerky. Confirm. You built that from scratch. Wow. I'm <laughs> impressed. Yes, cooking is building. Mm-hmm. 
Wait, I'm waiting. What am I waiting for? Are you saying you can't tell Limebot and I apart anymore? Help! Help. How did he even get here? Why Spice Girls? Because someone said stop right now and it just got into my head. Hello? I'm gonna be honest, I don't have high hopes for a friend. Oh look, bodies! Oh, isn't... Did I already go through here? I don't know. Anyway. Swoop. This is Vanguard Moira. Sorry if I had to reclaim some UC property. But this whole star yard is overrun. I've patched up my ship, and I'm heading to Neptune. Going to put in another request to get the fleet out here to deal with these spacers. But until then, if any of you thugs are listening, I'm the damn ghost stealing your stuff in the night. Clear out while you have the chance. He's almost daring the spacers to come after him. It's actually not a bad plan. Much better odds destroying one of their ships than fighting them all at once here. Okay. Industrial workbench? What's the difference? Uh... Huh. Do you ever get stressed by crafting systems? I honestly sometimes find that I don't want to interact with crafting systems because they just, like, it's too complex and I can never remember what I need and it just actually puts me off of doing anything at all. to Neptune. I can go to Neptune. Oh, I'm overweight again!
I think there might be a memory leak in the game though because looks like it's Neptune next. Want well, to see performance is like slowly getting worse. Like I'm not lagging. Oh no no no! I'm lagging quite regularly. I'm assuming... It must be these weighing me down, right? Okay. Can I fast travel out of here to go to my ship? Apparently not. <laughs> it's not specifically... Whenever I leave a menu, it just occasionally hitches now. Da -da -da. Da -da. Honestly, from what I can tell... Performance, it doesn't seem to be sort of like... Making a whole lot of sense for people. Like, I'll see people with top of the line stuff having more issues than mid range components. How do you figure out the locks? I just look at the, the gaps below. Like, I do the first set and then I do the set below and then I, I put everything in. Um. Aha! Is this how I get out? This looks right. To get this ship moving. <laughs> Something on your mind? <laughs> and is it hero work? Mm hmm. Okay, where should I go to sell? Oh, thanks, Zeros. Yeah, it's, it's not too bad, because you can see the lower layer before you commit to the upper layer. So, it's best to align everything that you can, because otherwise you can end up bamboozled and, and completing the lower la the upper layer wrong. That someone managed to get there or to travel between planets and it took like hours or something. This ship definitely feels a lot faster. Seven hours to get to Pluto. From where? Yeah, chat's saying you can, Gray. It just takes a freaking age, apparently. You think my lucky shoes are still in that box? Oh, well, this station's seen better days. I, wonder I can't tell. I UC will ever fully restore it to its former glory.
That's a little surprising, isn't it? Out here on the edge of UC space. But it's just so quiet. Uh huh. May I? Was there something you needed? I hope we have what you need. Can I sell from my companion? Nope. That sucks. Now I don't know what to believe. Some people are like, oh yes, streamer, you totally can. And other people are like, no, streamer, don't be silly. Do I have to talk to her and get all this Hopefully, stuff? Our vanguard will bring me anything useful. No, I'm taking all your shit, sorry. Actually, you can keep the coachman for now. Is it just me or stuff worth a lot more before you actually get to a vendor? Like the vendor's like, oh, I can give you, I can give you five dollars for it. Bye bye. Good to see you. Certainly. Yeah, it's like weapon value 3,000 and then you sell it for like 200 or some shit. I hate games when they do that. Although I did just make like 11k, so that's not too bad. I think. Oh, no, 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 I made like 5k. Never mind. Ooh. Yeah, I think if I'm gonna mod this game, one of the number one things I'll mod in is, uh... Higher weight limit, because holy moly. I f yeah, I feel- I feel like I have about 10 so, units you of weight to play with, and <laughs> I'm just overweight again. Locker. Is that what I wanted, or was it something else? What was this ship storage called? Maybe it was Captain's Locker. Oh, it's above the locker? Oh, transfer. Oh. What am I supposed to do with all my resources, then? I got too much shit? Actually, wait. Wait, 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 think, what would you do in my shoes? Sell it? But what if I need it?
Yeah, this... Why does this ship have so much stuff? It's got 270 out of 200. How, how does it have so many things? I guess these are all here before, because I stole this ship. <laughs> huh. Jesus, it's You're crazy. looking splendid today, Captain. Uh huh. <laughs> Go to the shipyard. Customize my ship. Oh, you know what? It's scary. <laughs> I just want to do the same things I'm always doing, and 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 not have to worry about stuff. Adapting the way that I play games, disgusting, really. I want to do these things the same way every time and then get mad if it doesn't work. Is that okay? Okay, thank you. <laughs> Change my ship's hair color? Oh, okay. <laughs> thank you very much, everybody. I will finish there, I think. I am tired because... I don't know. I've just not been sleeping very well, which is kind of annoying. I think yesterday my stomach was really hurting. So... Uh, I'm still sniffly! I would like to not have many, many weeks of sniffling. That would be very good. But, no, I appreciate having you guys here.